And now, another episode of Crit Camp Gaming. Lyle, we got cocky. We, we got, got we got we got a little cocky. We got cocky, man. We got yeah. cocky. We got yeah, cocky. Don't get, don't get cocky, kid. Yeah, yeah, don't get cocky, kid. We got cocky. We thought we were the bomb. Our luck was working out for us. Yeah. And then we beat us. We beat ourselves. I mean, and that's and that's usually the case. You know? As as the old band lit would say okay you are our own worst enemy <laughs> wait is it nice. lit or was it um uh... yeah i forgot for what band that was you hang it from like everclear was it <laughs> you hang it from a bed post or something <laughs> yeah <laughs> on a four post bed or, or something like that yeah no no i think that's uh sugar ray that's did sugar you send ray? it up the flagpole and see <laughs> oh set up the flagpole <laughs> yeah. uh was it was it like that yeah yeah, yeah, oh. it was it was it was, it was kind of like that, but yeah, we we got we uh, we you know because we because we played this game <laughs> for a very long time, we thought we knew the rules, but yeah, but like think. like usual, we we don't know anything, and yeah. uh, we had to get learned on a little bit from multiple Again. sources here, um, from multiple so iterations. You guys of in chat were talking about it. You guys in Discord were talking about it. You guys in uh, in YouTube have left some comments. Yeah, that um, hey. You probably could have stacked all the damage on the dog. We could have killed the uh, dog. We could have killed the dog. And whoever was the handler got one one hit too. But yeah. um Yeah. But that's what could happen. And I mean, people were just like, You guys have done this in the past. You guys could have stacked it. And we're like, Well, you know what? <laughs> Sometimes when you play when you're playing lots well, of other familiars. games and the and, and the reason it works is on the side and you're forgetting <sighs> the rules. I mean, dude, you know? I don't want my... I mean, this is how I look at it, Lyle. Okay, we yeah. could have stacked the damage and just killed our doggy friend. But yeah. when you killed our doggy friend, like, what's the point of living? Once we've... We, we don't have the dog anymore. We we had a connection. We were like Will Smith in that zombie movie that's like the end of times. And it's... We're his... Yeah. I think he had like a, a German Shepherd. Yeah. And, uh, you know, like... If well, that dog died, what's the point of life, dude? What's the point of well, going on? Yeah. Our companions I mean, or, dead. Or, I mean, another movie. I mean, John Wick. I mean, you would have you would have went on a rage, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. One of us would have went mm -hmm. on a rage and just killed everybody else. I mean, John Wick—they <laughs> can't kill the dog. You can't kill the can't dog and John Wick. Dog. You kill the dog and John Wick, people are gonna be mad, dude. Yo, dude, I finally saw John Wick three. By the way, <laughs> oh, I feel good, right? Oh, it, it was so good. So good. So Speaking good. Speaking of like amazingly trained doggos, yeah, yeah. that was ridiculous. Yeah, they're jumping over lava. <laughs> Dude, I was so pumped about that whole scene. It was I sad was though. Like people were, I think in chat were saying this, or I was talking to somebody. Maybe it was Scott. Um, that the most disappointing thing about that scene was that no dude was thrown into the lava. Like nobody oh, was know. thrown into a smelter. Yeah, I know. Like, I come know. on, missed I, I opportunity. Kept, I, I was like, I kept waiting for it. But one guy, <laughs> come on. Yeah, wait, just one guy, just one guy. Yeah, please, come on. <laughs> But yeah, like gun scene where they're like fighting with the knives and they keep breaking the glass and get a new knife and they like throw a new knife and then they're like, no, oh, like well, that was so early in the movie too. Oh, I and know, I'm like, I was like, this is phenomenal. Dude, John Wick. <laughs> and you know what? I love watching John Wick movies on the airplane because it gets me psyched for wherever I'm going. Like, I'm always like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's kind of like, it's kind of like that, dude. You can't kill off the companion. Yeah, you can't like, kill off, you can't kill off the dog. Like in canine, canine cop. Can't kill yeah. a dog. Actually, did the dog die in that movie? I think he does die in that movie. Yeah, it's been a long time. I think his. I think. I think he does die in that movie, and it's very sad, as I recall yeah. now. I remember I kind of shed a tear in Canine Cop. Doesn't he? Does anybody know? Is, is it Canine Cop or is it um, the other dog police movie where the dog dies and you're like, that's sad. Yeah, that's right. House rules say no sacrificing doggos. Exactly. We just had to end the game. Basically, is what yeah, I'm we, saying. Yeah, basically. Yeah, we lost a dog. And we were like, we we can't, can't go. We can't Hooch. go forward now. That's right. The movie was Hooch. Remember the movie Hooch? Hooch. Spoilers. <laughs> I think we're over two weeks since Hooch came out. Um, <laughs> Are we? Yeah, I think it's two weeks in the past. Ah, oh, EKG subbing every week with 20 months. Thank okay, <laughs> again, is this real? Is this not real? How do you do I don't that? Know. How does that happen every time? I don't get it. <laughs> Hooch, does the, canine, space, does the dog but, die in Canine Cop? I don't know. <laughs> I don't think the dog dies in Canine Cop. Tom Hanks wouldn't let that happen. Or was Tom Hanks in Hooch? Which one was Tom Hanks in? Is it, is it just Hooch or is it Turner and Hooch? No, no, no. It's Hooch. Was it Turner and Hooch? I think it was. Yeah, Turner and Hooch. Was that the Tom Hanks movie? Yeah, that's Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks was Turner and Hooch. Yeah, and Hooch dies. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Bill, Bill says <laughs> Old Yeller. Spoilers. <laughs> God, don't spoil Old Yeller for the kids, man. 
Turner and Hooch. Yeah, and I think the dog dies in that, it doesn't he, at the rough, end? dude. I think he Old takes bullets rough. for Tom Hanks or something, isn't it? He, like, goes yeah. after the guy, and, like, yeah. And Hooch totally fits the, the thing, dude. Yeah, dude, yeah. These dogs can't die. Yeah. Man, that was a sad movie, man. I'm now looking at these pictures of Hooch, and it, no, it has the picture of the pictures scene. Of Hooch, man. Dude, Hooch Just was awesome. Assumed. Dude, Hooch was great. Anyway, moral of the story is... <laughs> We, lo- we lost a familiar last game, and then and so we were so emotionally wrecked that we just had to stop the game. We, could, we couldn't so go that's on. What I, so that what, was what that was. So, oh, dude, look at him. Dude, look, look how look big him, Hooch dude. was, man. Hooch was huge. Oh, Hooch man. See, if, if we saw that dog die, like, Hooch had puppies. That's right. The story goes on. That's right. Hooch has puppies, guys. <laughs> they killed Hooch, but Hooch had the puppies. So the puppies live on to make more Hooches. That's right. He made more Hooch. Yeah, baby Hooch. Yeah. 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 Okay, cool. So we still have Hooch. Hooch lives on for Hooch. Did they ever make a Hooch 2? They should make Hooch 2. <laughs> Hooch, Hooch 2. <laughs> they should make Turner and Hooch 2. Welcome to the camp, fat, fat lazy slug. Fat, You're just in time slug. to talk about Turner and Hooch. Turner and Hooch 2 would be awesome. Oh, Bill. Nice. He says, at least we know all dogs go to heaven. That is, wow. Yes. I like that. Yes. I like that. Yes. I like that throwback. We always will have that. But yeah, man. Now I'm, now I'm like sad. No, I'm sad, dude. Why? Why did you? Yeah. Why we? Why do we have that? to bring up Hooch, dude? I'm looking at yeah, this. Why we up and there's, there's okay. Even... So anyway, <sighs> long story short, we are. You can see down here. Attempt two. Quest four. Infected tides. Attempt two. Um. Yeah, but we still have to all survive. So, so if one of us oh. dies, we can't. Oh, dude, you can't. <laughs> you know, I'm just gonna go on like this. I'm a big Tom Hanks fan, but. <laughs> this is me now dude this is me yeah, now dude. Is me i'm now. your hooch dude i'm your hooch rough rough i'm your hooch <laughs> i'm your hooch this is what the people want this is what the people need this is what the people want well. so well <laughs> <laughs> it's lyle and hooch dude lyle and hooch lyle and hooch right here lyle and hooch are we okay with lyle and hooch yeah <laughs> <Whoop. laughs> there now it's official Chris yeah, Mittens. Middle. So, Lyle and Hooch, best best show on Twitch. Um, this needs to be the thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, Lyle. G- give me a uh, give me a, give me a, a little pat. I wish I was on the other side. I, I wish I could. Oh, I, I, I know. Yeah. Or 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 wait. <laughs> <laughs> wait. <laughs> it looks like you're. Arr, arr. Oh, oh. <laughs> it looks so real. Har, 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 har. Never kill a doggy and Turner and Hooch. Oh, oh, right there in the ear. Right there. Right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a raunchy cop drama. So, guys, Quest 4, Infected Tide. We're going to take on Tracked and Fight again, and we've got new survivors, and it's going to be amazing. Top dog. Best doggo. Best doggo. Our our, our numbers on Twitch better go up because doggo stream now. I know. Top dog. <laughs> Top dog. YouTube. I'm going to hashtag uh, doggo. Doggo. So, yeah. In honor of Hooch from Turner and Hooch, we had to end the, the quest last time. We've got, new, we've got new survivors. We're ready to do this again, so it's on us. We appreciate everyone leaving the comments. You guys were right. Even someone on YouTube. Um was saying like not bad for a youtuber <laughs> which was really yeah. cool it was really funny yeah, yeah no I, I really like that comment not bad yeah. for a youtuber yeah yeah, yeah. It's like okay <laughs> thanks man yeah mm-hmm. so youtube did a great job but yep. so we're gonna move on today we're gonna take it on lyle how was keyforge last how were keyforge last night lyle uh keyforge was well i didn't go to keyforge last night um because oh. i had freelance work to do uh, and that's how i was oh, able to, right. I to do a little skype night thing with you <laughs> oh right 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 <laughs> that's right uh i wanted to go to keyforge it was open play uh my keyforge group were all texting each other um and uh yeah most most of everybody went last night i couldn't go architect josh couldn't go uh-huh. um but i got some freelance work done and uh it's might i might have some more stuff to do today and tomorrow so yay Freelance hey. work, yay! As emails just come in, you know, and you're like, "Great, I thought we finished." No, okay. <laughs> oh, oh that, that's not good, Lyle. No, no, it's not good. Yeah, speaking of speaking of the game that we shouldn't speak of, um, I uh, I played that deck that I got on Monday on the Crucible a few times, and actually been losing with it. And I found it. I found out its weakness was the fact that it doesn't have any big sweepers. Like it does damage. Yeah, with the board clears, right, is what you said. Yeah. So I end up having yeah. to use my. I mean, it has chances to do bursty stuff off damaged other people, but 
but it just is hard to get a win with. It's like real. Yeah, you have you have you have a lot of direct damage in that deck, but it's small direct damage. Yeah. Uh, so it's yeah, like so look, if you're going against like big dinos, you're like, oh, like, God, it was like, tough, dude. That's exactly what I was running into. And people with yeah. crazy dino combo decks that were just like, why, 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 why? And I was like, yeah. oh, my gosh, man, <laughs> it's like you guys are insane. And you could oh, it was rough. So I actually went back to a 73 SAS deck I have um, that uh, does really well. And I was like, man, why haven't yeah. you been playing this? <laughs> like, well, that's that's another one of those things where there's a there's a deck that I had from AOA that I could not win with. And then one day it clicked in my mind that I was like, oh, this deck doesn't care what the opponent does. And I, and and basically it was it's a super fast deck, but it didn't have clears. Yeah. And then I once I started playing that deck being like, I don't care what you have on your board. I'm just playing my game to gain Amber. Right. Then it changed my whole play style. And then I started getting a win rate with 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 that particular deck. Yeah. And that deck's only like mid 60s. You know, but it actually has one of the best win rates I have because nobody suspects it because, you know, it's it's just a little bit different than the usual stuff in the meta where you're like actually amber yeah. controlling and you're board controlling and stuff like that. Like, I just don't care. I'm well, just, just doing my own thing. I just found I needed to fight fire with fire. And I was just I just the deck I'm using is a big dino combo deck and it even has the uh, Star Alliance key cheat in it. So. Mm. I was like, bada bing, bada boom. But in other yeah, board bing, game news, I, uh, I've got my uh, I got my quiver packed up. I got the quiver packed up. I got all kinds of games in there. I got party so games. What's, yeah, got, what's in what's in the quiver these days? Well, I got party games. I got um, I got uh, I got party games. I I, know I have the quiver upstairs because I have to get it ready for traveling. Tomorrow. Oh, okay. I've got uh, I threw some medium in there. Threw where words in there. Uh, Trash pandas, the mind, fox in the forest, guillotine. Uh, I put zombie flux in there. Mm -hmm. uh, uh batman love letters in there what else is in there um i'm not actually gonna bring Keyforge, dude because I, I figure every time i brought well, you my... brought it last time right it's like and, i don't know um, when i work were, with plays they weren't it. so into it right people i mean I, I have to find a game shop and i've been looking like i'm um i'm looking and uh, i yeah. talked to i i messaged a couple of the game shops out around that area and no and they're both like no we don't do Keyforge here no you yeah. can bring your stuff we have open tables you can come play but everyone's just like nah plus i think it's competing with magic stuff and just yeah. it's just not there man so I, I see these messages where people are saying it's it's like like you've got a scene going there um minneapolis has a scene according to reld and some people are saying there's a scene but i mean like i don't know how, where these pockets are or like if it's just pockety like i think it's just pockety right i i, I feel lucky that i have a scene here um so like you really gotta make it happen. if there if there was no scene Ohio's here i'd to have Phil. to drive two hours north to louisville because right. there's a scene there, right? Um, and so you just have to find where it is. Because I know that, like, there are people in Chattanooga, which is, like, an hour and a half south of here, that have definitely driven up to my shop to play Keyforge. Because they're just kind of like, there's nothing well, there. Well, I want to play this game, but it's not not, it's not really happening down there, yeah. you know? And it, so, so I think it is, like, pockets. And it's, like, if you're lucky enough to have people that are showing up for it. Yeah. I mean, that'd be like me yeah. driving to Philly basically to go play Keyforge, Yeah. And like, I mean, if there was a big tournament thing or if like a big championship or something like that, I get it, but I'm not going to do that just to play Keyforge. I mean, it just is, uh, it's tough, man. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Like, yeah, how the, it's not doing well here, but my name, I know people yeah. are like, well, you got to make the scene. You got to do it. And I'm like, dude, if I didn't have work, kids, family time, it's, I would, yeah, it, no, it's a, it's a job. It's a job to make your scene. And, and, and um, you know, you have to, you have to be consistent. It's like it's like streaming, right? You have to be consistent. Yeah. You gotta show up and you gotta make sure that like whatever. So it's like when Keyforge happens on Tuesdays here in my local shop, it's like like last night, like I felt really bad because it was sort of just like that's an open play night. I have work to do. Like I would go and that's when that's when the actual new people come up, mm -hmm. right? Because they don't wanna do tournaments. Like they wanna come up like on, on the casual open play night, right? And then Whoever whoever shows up, like of uh, my my the usual suspects, like stays and teaches people how to play keyboards, right? And we just cross our fingers that they're gonna show up for like the actual well, yeah, you're next to, event. You're trying to keep the scene going. I mean, yeah, we're trying to keep the scene going. I, mean, so I felt really bad about like not going, but it's just like you know when it doesn't work on my schedule. But then yeah, yeah the, but then I'm like I have the guilt, right? It's just yeah, like, you're like oh, I'm, I'm not, not doing you know. my part in like keeping the scene going. <laughs> yeah, Zession says there's a lot of anger locally of FSS Jewel. Yeah, with the layoffs recently, has been rough. People have been getting angry about FFG even outside your local scene. I mean, there's been posts around the internet. People have always had this quip with FFG and the way they handle a lot of their products. Yeah. Um, 
you know, I can't speak to that. I mean, F, uh, this is probably the biggest thing besides Destiny we've dove into. Um, and when we started getting into Destiny, it was on its way out, and now it's officially gone. Like, I mean, it's yeah. well, interesting. It, no, it's it's complete. Dude. Yeah. Bill says, I think I've mentioned this before, but we created a Discord group for the area and has really helped keep people engaged, talk about decks, events, casual meetups. Yeah, I mean, I, we have a Facebook group. I don't really use Facebook as much as I uh, as a lot of people, but there's people on there that in our local area had a Facebook group, but it's like yeah. that even died off. Like, yeah. people will keep an eye. Like, So what's weird around here, and I don't know why we're talking about Keyforge. We got to get into Zombicide. Yeah. But like... <laughs> Um, Because we always always talk about keyboard. Yeah, but like, I mean, I just happen to be talking about the Iowa scene out there. There's not one out there. At least I didn't find it, at least in in terms of the game shops knowing about it, which makes me think there's not one. Um, But like here, it was like people are still connected to that group and everyone's just sort of waiting for someone to take the reins. But whenever someone's tried to take the reins, it's like a burst, right? There was that Kappa Cup. Like someone took the reins, a good number of people showed up, but those people were like, okay, I'm not, you know, they're not going to show up again for Keyforge. They're more interested yeah. in Armada and like, you know, playing those games. Destiny was yep. big for them, like, <laughs> which sucks yeah. for them. Um, but it was like they were they weren't going to come out. We're like, hey, yeah, you guys should come out. We should do this again in two weeks on a Wednesday or two weeks on a Saturday or something. And everyone's yeah. like, yeah, and I. That's when I play Star Wars Armada. That's when I play this. That's when I have yep. to, you know, that doesn't work for me. Wednesday's not good for me. You know, everyone doesn't have a good for me time, and it's sort of like. Yeah. I know Xbox has really honed his scene and grown it. Matt is grinding his scene out, um, yeah. out in New Mexico. I mean, if I mean, if you really love the game, you have the time to grind the scene. I get it. Like it's it's worth doing, I guess, if you can get the backing. But yep, um, yeah, it's just tough. It's tough, and I think that goes with any game. Like if I was a big Zombicide yeah, I mean, fan, this and... is not. Yeah, this isn't a problem. Um, this isn't a problem <laughs> with um, with with just Keyforge. I mean, yeah, it's it's any game, and the thing is like. A lot of times people only have like one time and they can only like one time a week or one time every couple of weeks where they can play a game and they have to choose from the multitude of games. Right. Which game is going to be the game that they play. Right? Yeah. yeah. And, <laughs> and, and, and it's tough because it's like if you have multiple interests, you know, or like you really like magic or you really like X-Wing or you really like Netrunner and you're just like, well, am I really going to devote my time to play Keyforge over the other game? You know, yeah. so... It's competing with other games that you could possibly be playing, and then you know you're competing against like what the you know what your area right is deems in, yeah. the most popular, and so you're like, I really want to play Keyforge, but nobody else is playing Keyforge in my area. It's like, what am I gonna do? Like, not play a game or go play that game, you know? Mm-hmm. Um, and so yeah, it's just it's just rough. I think, you know, I, I, it's hard to say, you know, like sweeping if like, you know. Keyforge is struggling or not, whatever. It's just you see what you see in your local scene, um, right. <laughs> you know. And and for me, it doesn't look like it's struggling at all. Like, like my local guy is buying product all the time, you know. And we're doing we're doing an event every week, and so it doesn't feel that way. And we're always seeing new people come in and and learn. They may not show up consistently, but we're seeing you know a fair amount of people come in and at least learn the game. Um, so, so there's that, but yeah. And then, but then there's like other scenes where like you guys just aren't playing at all. And I, I think that sucks. Yeah. I mean, you're right. There's just how many, and then yeah, ETG, I mean, ETG says the MTG takes up four days. I mean, I've talked to other shop owners. I like to talk to Oh people. yeah. MTG is, is, yeah. It just takes up is, is the one that's always priority for everybody. Yeah, it's four days a week. I mean, that's true. I mean, you, and like <clears throat> a shop owner up in totally. New Jersey told me, he was like, he's like, I wish we could do more stuff. He's like, I didn't want to do magic here, but magic is essential for a shop to thrive brick and mortar yeah. has to host magic the gathering or you're yeah. you're canceling out a huge cash cow that's going to pay your bills and yeah. no one's going to show up from the scene right yeah um, well yeah it's, it's funny because it's like when we were when uh my local group was talking to the shop owner basically about what what day to move keyforge was because we used to play it on thursdays um and we're like, oh, he's like, well, we're going to move Keyforge. And we're like, okay, well, what day is it? And he's like, well, we can only move it to one other day because I have other things like magic. <laughs> like scheduled. Right. You're like, oh, okay. So it wasn't, okay. <laughs> like, and people are showing Tuesday up then. for it. I mean, here's, here's my final thing on it is the fact that yeah. games like this, what's happening. I mean, like we said, there's a lot of like things going on with FFG behind the scenes and business wise and all that kind of stuff. I'm just kind of bummed that, um, now it's getting like condensed to certain areas and they have their big championships and things are going to condense. It's like, it's almost like they're, oh, spin the wheel, Mr. Draco with his 10,000. 
Man, you got a lot of Twitch crits. How are you earning so many Twitch crits? I think we gotta fix this I thing. I don't know. Soon. I have like I have like twenty thousand Twitch crits. <laughs> yeah, all right, spinning the wheel, and I have something. But um, but we have gonna... we have. Are we spinning the wheel for EKG though as well? Is that a legit one? Well, he said it's a bug. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I, I think we already did for that sub. <laughs> But okay. um, I uh, but what I was just gonna say is that I think it's kind of a bummer that a game like that, um, and maybe some other games too do this, is that they wait till the game's physical, um, interest wanes. They wait for scenes to sort of like they t- they gauge I don't know general interest in purchasing, like you said. I don't know how they would gauge it, but then that's when they decide to make a digital version to just grab that last bit of money and then done. Yeah, you know what I mean. Like and then so I, yeah. I think that's what's gonna happen with Keyforge. I think they're gonna, um. They're gonna, they're gonna, uh, if Asmodee is getting rid of whatever, like they're gonna, they're gonna sell it off to Asmodee eventually, get the money from that, and then Asmodee is gonna use it to try to pull out of it what they can. Hopefully they do it well, and then realize that they maybe grab some Hearthstone money with it, and it's fun, but then at that point they'll just let it be what it is, and I'm like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> like, what I think, I think someone like the, the, um, I think Nomad and AEG with like Smash Up, for instance, you know, this game's been out forever. Um, and then they made a huge cross-platform thing, made it on Switch, they made it on everything, made it, and they haven't put out a ton of content for it, but then they see some interest with it, and they're like, okay, cool. They're like, now we'll put out more content for it. Like, so, I don't know if they're doing it right. Like, who's doing it right, yeah. who's doing it wrong, I don't know. But, um, yeah, that well, that's what's going on here, and I'm just saying, I, I, want, I brought this up because um, going to a new city, I've already checked into the new city, and I'm kind of like, ah. <laughs> so yeah, that's why yeah. I'm not bringing Keyforge in my quiver, because... Uh, I mean, that's unless fine. someone I work with is like, hey, I, I like Keyforge. And I'm like, what? Like, yeah. if, if someone says that to me, I'm going to be like, stand by. I'm either going on Amazon. I'm going to order a starter set, like, immediately just to play with them. Or yeah, yeah. I'm going to go to a local game shop like I did, I think, last time I was in Iowa when, when World's Yeah, buy, buy, buy a starter set. And I'll, buy, yeah. I'll be like, dude, dude tonight, I'm going to go up here. I'm going to drive to north 45 minutes to go to this game store because they have a set i'm gonna buy their starter set drive back here and then i'm gonna uh then we're gonna play some these things right i would be i would do that it's a cool game night thing and then i would give it to him i would keep my deck <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> or or maybe i don't know but no i would i would probably leave it with him and just be like cool i hope you had fun that's that's what that game is maybe that's what richard garfield wanted the game to be because he was sick of how yep. mtg had grown this huge secondary market people were just buying cards selling cards making a huge meta and he was like i don't want that to be this i want keyboard to just be a game like yeah. me he's not even interested really in the competitive scene maybe you know what i mean and he just wants it to and everything everyone's trying to turn it into is like an mtg like a pokemon like a Yu Gi Oh, like have this big scene and maybe it's it's gotten to the point where richard garfield smart guy is like this is as big as it can get like yeah. guys it's not gonna get bigger than that you buy a deck you play your deck that's it's a game it's a board game it's a smash up you buy smash up you play smash up yeah this is what it is I'm not making yep. anything else out of it. <laughs> like, stop <laughs> trying to think it's going to turn into MTG. It's not. It's not MTG. <laughs> Go play MTG. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, man. So let's do we owe a wheel spin, though? He said no. He we do. Honest. We do owe a wheel spin to Mr. Draco, okay. not for, right. for ETG. All right. ETG spin says that. he's honest. Um, yeah. And he's and he's mentioning, of course, Transformers and, and Marvel uh, Champions yeah. LCG. Um, Transformers does not exist here in my scene. Um, it exists here. It's huge here. So yeah, maybe we should start not, playing that for me. It's not a big Keyboard thing here. Um, <laughs> but Marvel Champions, I think, is ramping up. And um, I, I, I'm sad. A couple of weeks ago, I couldn't go. Um, but my local shop did a sort of a learn and play of the oh. Marvel stuff, uh, which would have been cool to go to because um, I definitely want to like just check that yeah, out. We're gonna try it. That's about. That's to come, guys. Incoming. Yeah. Incoming. Yeah. Incoming. All right, dude. Let's spin this wheel for Mr. Draco, and then let's get in here, dude. And while All we right. spin this for Mr. Draco and his ten thousand Twitch crit support, dude, I I was at Target today and I picked up a fresh new box of Bean Booze and Garbage. Oh, jeez. Bought some garbage. Um. So because mine was almost out. Straight after trash, the, dude. Oh, oh happened to of garbage. Speaking of garbage, thanks. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> I just jinxed it, didn't I? And then we're going to play some Zombicide for the kids. Zombicide. This was the first one that came out. Okay. This oh, one is, also uh, what's in the in the quiver, I've got uh, Pass the Pigs, which, Bill, did you go check out Pass the Pigs? Pass the Pigs, good times, good times. Pigs. So I opened it up, fresh new box. They're not kidding, guys. These are real. This is how it comes, as you know. Ugh. Smells. Yep. Smells this like is, bad. Uh, this, is stinky, this is stinky socks or tutti frutti. Hopefully, I think last time we did this, I spilled them all over the floor, didn't I? You did. What'd you get? Stinky socks, tutti frutti? No, nope, tutti frutti. I have to refill this stupid thing. Mr. Draco says, Keyforce doesn't exist around here. Everyone I talk to hates the pre-made decks. Yeah, I mean, that's a general opinion coming from, I've heard a lot of hardcore Magic no, the Gathering no, folks. When you're trying to convert a lot of current Magic players, it's hard. 
Yeah, deck building. When you're trying to recruit a bunch of X Magic players, it seems easier. <laughs> yeah, I think. Forge. Yeah, I mean, if if you really enjoy buying singles and building your best deck and trying to counter a meta and stuff like that by tweaking your deck and sideboarding, then yeah, Key Forge is not for you. The best sideboarding you can do is literally play another deck. Yeah. Um, you know, which some but, prefer, um, some don't. Yeah, but Bill's saying Marvel's awesome. I'm really enjoying it so far. Yeah, I really want to get into it. Yeah, the tabletop Bill's also been playing guys. lots of Tim Tim guys. So <laughs> Tim Tim God. I tried to watch Lyric play it yesterday. The servers were so slammed on the release. Bill's trying to pull us into Tim Tim. Bill's trying to pull us into Tim Tim. And uh, so it was really funny. I, I okay. showed Guards. I showed Casey the trailer for Tim Tim last night, and she she slowly looked over at me and she goes, "This is this is a parody, right? This is like oh yeah, it's totally. This is made up. Oh, like look and what like, popped out. Dish I'm like, no, this is like real. And she's like, but it's just Pokemon. I was like. <laughs> Yeah, I know. <laughs> they know it. I think they've even advertised it as so. All right, guys. So dishwater, Curtis and Mr. Draco. Yep. And it's dishwater. Oh God. Oh, dude, I'm sorry. I, I deserve I, this after I you got punished. On Monday. It was bad. No, no. After you got punished. Oh God. Oh. Speaking of dishwater, my dish, my dishwasher broke. Yay! New no, new I don't think I don't think it's my dishwasher. I have to get an electrician to because like I've been having <laughs> I forgot I forgot. Who tell me about it. it. Tell, tell me about it, Lyle. I'm your I'm your faithful but yeah, companion. Um, my my electrical is kind of wonky in this old old house, and for a while my dishwasher was like turning on and off by itself, <laughs> and uh, now it's just not turning on at all. So. It, when your dishwasher becomes sentient, Lyle, it's time. Yeah. it's it's a sign of the times yeah. to change it. Yeah, it, like it wasn't starting itself, but it would just do like the ring that it was like ready to start, right? <laughs> and that usually only happens when you like open the door. And so like it would be in the middle of the night and you'd be like, and I'd be like, what? I'm ready, go, I'm ready to go, Lyle. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. Like, stop. You're not ready to go. I didn't <laughs> I'm ready to go. Let's door. do it. And it'd be like, boop, boop, boop. Let's go. Let's go. Like, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's wash some dishes, dude. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically. And then and then basically it was just like, well, if you don't want me to wash any dishes, then uh, then I'll just shut off forever. <laughs> oh, God, <this> beam. <laughs> Miss Bean My dishwasher's like... a teenager. No. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Sounds like Avery. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, this, oh, wow, I got into the trash and I ate a bunch of dish towels. <laughs> <laughs> this is what my mouth tastes like right now. My mouth tastes like Hooch's mouth. <laughs> oh, God. Ugh. All Gross. right, so let's get into uh, Quest for Infected Tides, guys. i um, not going to go over, I'm not going to read the lore because we already did on uh, uh, recently, last week. So, uh, Lyle, just give us a quick overview again of what we're trying to do in this mission here. Okay, we're trying to reach exit with everyone. Nobody can die. And to do that, we have to um, we have to find at least one blue X or at least one green X hidden amongst the red Xs. When you pick up a red X, you get 5 XP. When you pick up a red X, you actually uh, resolve a spawn on that blue spawn. The blue spawn's not active from the start. When you pick up the blue X, which is the blue key that opens those, the blue door... The blue spawn becomes active permanently. Um, and when you pick up the green X, that's just the green key. So basically what we're trying to do is if we can find the green key, which we did last time, which was great, early, then we can just make a beeline to the exit. Um, if we can't find the blue or the green key, we have to keep searching these X's until we find a key, and then we can leave. Um, and basically that's it. Yeah, man. That sounds good. So we decided to change up the team based on the fact that there's like a ton of water. There's a ton yeah, of water. Ton of water, water all water. And we got to, we got to here, basically, and the water slowed us down. We died to rats and our dog died right here and there was no reason to go on. Yep. <laughs> is what we're gonna stick with. Yeah, is, basically. Is what we're gonna say. Let me just uh do some quick change here that I forgot to do before the show. Bloop, 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 bloop. Settings. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Um, so what we're going to do is we decided at the end of the show, if you watched the last episode, uh, we talked a lot about some changes we should make to the team to help us get through this water. Um, we do have to keep in mind we're playing with, we're going to keep um, the same necromancer, Queen Severa, um, yep. who once again says, perform a ranged zombie action, zero to three, targeting the zone with most survivors within line of sight. Queen Severa will be our necro still. We're also keeping the vault warden as our, as our bad boy, um, yeah, he's a he's a he's a bad boy for life. But what we decided was that like, huh? We got stuck in the water. We got killed to rats, and um, before we've been slowed down by the spectrals. So we have to keep in mind both these new factors. The rats are brutal. They're savage, and they've killed mm -hmm. they've killed someone in the last two quests we've played. Last we, two quests, and yeah. we can't die. Nobody can die. And so, um, doggy died um, to rats, which is sad. Um, so we need to figure out a way to move faster than the rats in the water, basically, in any yep. zombies, and kill a spectral still. So the team we've kind of come up with is, I'll be starting with, uh, speaking of water, a fish. 
I'm good. Yeah. It's a, a trap. A fish, man. It's, it's a tarp. It's a tarp. It's a tarp. It's a trap. So we got Cardinal Binbauer. Um, he starts with a lightning ball. We're starting with that because this is going to be like our spectral counter. Start with an awesome spell um, that we can just blast this dude with. Now, I'm forgetting what lightning ball... Uh, I forget what lightning ball does, but there's very few people that actually start with a spell. Yeah. Um, and so we just basically did a quick search of, of <laughs> people that start with a, a combat spell. I wanna, and this guy uh, came up. I want to guess that lightning ball is uh, like z uh, four plus or four plus hit on a roll and i think it's if you roll a six it you it triggers again you chain it i think that's lightning ball not lightning what's the other lightning spell we always get lightning bolt is the yeah. one where you have like three range and it's four four plus yeah four plus so four this plus. might be four plus with uh the the uh with the exploding chain. dice yeah <laughs> we might get some um you know some yeah. cool mini or not but he later magic. gets plus one die magic and plus one max range which is all which is all good things yeah. okay cool so there we go so we're gonna starting with uh starts with lightning ball which is gonna be pretty good stuff um, then I'm going to stick with Lucas, um, uh, Liam Neeson's for our born leader. And this is what we talked about before guys, we're going to stack some born leader action, give a free action to somebody. Cause we need actions to move through this water. Cause yep. when we got that green X, it was literally like a run. Let's just run. Let's go. And yeah, we just run. Yeah. Run. Get green X, run. <laughs> um, we need to move faster. And then Genevieve will be our ranged, uh, a ranged bomb and a bomb killer. Yep. We yeah. need it. So we need that for the help of killing a bombs. Because Bill says we need someone that starts with a wheel of cheese so you can throw away distractor rats. <laughs> yeah, yes. right. Because that's how it works. They, they prefer yeah. human flesh. They're zombie yeah. rats, dude. Yeah, we've learned They're zombie this. rats now. They don't. They don't. They don't care for the cheese. Well, what are you, what are, right what are you doing here? Uh, Cabral uh, has the shove. This guy. This skill has saved us in many a mission, not just in uh, friends and foes, but for all of modern and 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 uh, black plague and stuff. Um, so can keep this guy. He's a base character for this set. Uh, guess he's got the shove. Yeah. Um, shove, shove, shove. And then we got Ulfo. Yep. And then we're going to play Ulfo. It's been a long time since we played Ulfo, but like Chris was saying with, with Lucas, uh, we're just picking guys with Born Leader to give you, give it ourselves extra actions. We got to move through the water. That's all that it is. Yeah. So later he gets plus one die to combat, which is great, but he's there specifically for Born Leader. And you could have my axe. Then you could have my axe. Uh, and then I'm going to play Dame Alisa, which has been a while. And it's been a while since I played this combo, guys. For for, 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 uh, for you guys who have been watching for a long time, it's the old ebb and flow combo. It's push a little and push and pull. So I have Cabral with the shove. Dame Alisa has lifesaver. This used to be my favorite skill of all time when we first started playing modern back in the day. Um, I think it was like the second season this uh this ability showed up and i was like this ability is op as heck yeah, uh, just to remind you lifesaver means if i'm adjacent to a zone um and I, and I have a buddy over there that has a zombie with them i can i can pull that person and anybody else that's in that zone to my zone and okay. save them that's Aye. a free action i can do it once per turn hey it's gonna be fun it's yep. gonna be fun lyle you yep. know what i just noticed before we move what? on there's a button down here that says filter I've never, I don't know what this button does at the very bottom of the, the screen. When did they... Can we filter the deck? Oh, you can filter by survivor name. Oh, uh, okay. By expansion. It's just, a, it's just a search. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool, though. You, we could, this is a lot easier than me scrolling through the freaking thing. Yeah. Or you can search nice. by expansion. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Wow, oh, look at that. I never saw that button before. Pretty yeah. No. Cool. Well, good. All right, so, boom. Um, so, it... There, there's our team. We're going to start the game up, and then we're going to distribute some uh, some gear. Um, yeah. Once again, Burnbauer has his lightning ball. We do get what was it? What spell do we? We get mana blast. So here's lightning. Oh, so there you go. Lightning ball. Oh, and it goes in your middle slot. Is that true? Oh, it's two dice four plus. Nice. Two and dice four plus with a range of two. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. So it this makes thing's noise, but it, it yeah. So I guess this wasn't the one that chains. There, there no. is something that chains. Maybe that's a vault weapon, like lightning strike or something like that. Yeah. 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 Um, so Burnbauer's rocking. So I'm just going to take a sword with him. Yep. Yeah. Um, Lucas, uh, I get, I can rock a short sword in the middle slot. Um, and so I get the born leader. So I'm yeah. just going to do that. I'm just going to go. Yeah. And then Genevieve, we want to give her the Sherpo. Yeah. Was this two damage? No, it was one damage. Okay. Yeah. One damage. Two range though. That's pretty sick. Okay. Genevieve, man, Burnbauer's awesome. Why have we been using Burnbauer? Yeah. Burnbauer's great, dude. <laughs> Yeah, Burnbauer's my favorite on this team with zero knowledge. I know, Bill. Like, I just realized, like, <laughs> wait, Burnbauer, this spell is amazing to start with. Like, I'd love to find this spell when we search the first time. Yeah. Two dice? What? Yeah. We're idiots. God. Yeah. Well, this Burnbauer, is the fun of discovering right? when you have too many survivors. It's like it's like Keyforge yeah. when you have too many decks and you go, wait, why haven't I been playing this deck the entire time? Yeah. All right, dude, what do you want for these bros? Uh, Give, uh, ooh. 
This is rough. You got some push pull, and then you got the extra action thing. So you got yeah. yeah you usually we're giving Cabral the hammer, but yeah, give Cabral the hammer, I guess. Okay. And then give Ulfa the sword, and then give Dame Elisa the mana blast. Well, she can rock a regular sword uh, middle yeah. slot, but um, and you can have my axe. All right, yeah, here we go. Axe. We're gonna move into the game, guys. It's game time. All right, we're starting over here because there is. Nothing over there except for the exit. Uh, I've yep. randomly placed these X's. You guys okay, see. and let's look. Okay, if we can get the blue or the green X in these one of these two X's, yeah. then we're still we're still we're still good. We're still yeah. good. So spoilers. Oh, and I got to put on our tabletop audio ambience for oh, yeah. for a good luck. Uh, I got to put that on. We've, we're ready to roll. We're ready to roll here. Get uh do some of this. Uh, where's where's my thing? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> there's a there's a ting sound. Um. This was the green X last time, which was amazing. Uh, so uh, hope for the best, guys. That would be amazing if that would happen again. And yeah. how many burpees do I owe? I just realized I still owe like 40 uh, You burpees. owe 40 burpees. Okay. I owe 10 push-ups. I got to bust yeah. those out today. I got to bust those yeah. out today. Um, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. Let's, let's rock and roll. Let's play some Zombicide, guys. Let's play some Zombicide. Yeah. Zombies. All right. So do you want me to start first? Let's see. We've got door yeah, openers. Start first. I've got two door opener potentials. We've got the short bow blaster guy. Yeah. Um, do I start with Lucas for the extra action? Um, let's see what happens. I'm going to start with uh, Liam Neeson's here. Liam Neeson's for good luck, dude. Liam Neeson's going to start right here. Uh, and he's going to yeah. bust open this door. Yeah. Right? Uh, Sean, that's called John Wick 3. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to whip this sword out. Which is came on Twitch. Scatterbrains. 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 Where <laughs> he dies at the end. Good one. All right. One time, we're going to bust this door open. Four plus. Whoop. Ah, it's oh, a miss right off fail. the bat. Two town. Two town. Okay, that's one noise. So let's try it again. Whoop. Dang, dude. Dang, dude. Dang, dog, dang. Okay, one time, one time. Ah! Wow. Doors are a thing, guys. All right, so who did you give the extra action to? Oh, Burn now I can give it to somebody. I'm going to give it to my other door opener. I'm going to give it yeah, to Burnbauer. Burn <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Burnbauer's getting the extra action. That's basically it. I yeah, just made Sansa's get good. Yeah, so maybe this is a good sign, Lyle, that we're going to survive this time. Yeah, I know. I was like, yeah, because when we have when we have good uh, good starts like this, okay, we got three noise. It's there only already. up from here. All right, so let's let's go to Burnbauer. He's gonna whip out his sword. He's got his free extra action. He's gonna use that yeah, to free open one. This. Yep. He's gonna use it to open leader. this door because this game's easy, man. It's gonna be easy. Whoop. Ah! <laughs> oh, for four. Okay, let's try okay. this One time. <laughs> yeah, okay, door crit. Twenty percent accuracy on doors. <laughs> Really great. Another reason we should use Burn Bauer. All right, let's spawn these rooms. Oh, dang, dude, can you believe that? Super trash mode right now. Um, spawn the spawn the room to the furthest point. Yeah. And it's rats right off the bat. <laughs> great. Two rats. Love rats, dude. This is what this is how it ends, man. This is how it ends. This is how, how it ends. This is how it ends. This is gonna be another quick one. Oh, enter the horde enter right the off horde. the bat. Right. But it's a Stop miss. The spawns. Stop all the spawning. Stop okay. all the spawning. <laughs> Four sandwiches. That will be... Uh, uh, Doolittle will be one of the biggest bombs of the year. Cats and Doolittle. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to go see cats. I can tell you that right now. Yeah, I'm not going to see cats. And um, I have a better chance of seeing Doolittle than I do cats. That's all I'm going to say. Who's playing Dr. Doolittle? Isn't it... Uh, who is Iron it? Man? Oh, it is him. It is Iron Man. <laughs> That's, why, that's why we're talking about this. That would make sense. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't know. I might see Doolittle because of my kids, but I think that movie would freak them out. So it won't be happening. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I can shoot these rats. No, I can't because I'm, that's interior, isn't it? No, no, no. You can, uh, yeah, yeah. You have to move I up have to, move in to one. get on the site. Yeah. And then I get two shots of the rats. So maybe I should do that. So Burnbauer's going in. Burnbauer going in. Rawr. And Burnbauer's going to lightning ball. Lightning ball. Yeah. Lightning. Uh, Lightning bow. Two with a crit. Oh, nice, dude. Get out of here, With a crit. Effing rats. <laughs> dude, Burnbauer, OP. Burnbauer. Burnbauer, our hero. He's the hero we need. Yeah. All right. Oh, no. Lucas is done. Uh, I forgot to hit intern on his turn. All right. Genevieve's going to go in. Genevieve. Uh, Scatterbrain says, have you had a chance to play Invader yet? No, we have not played Next. Invader yet. And so the way that we've been doing our whole run through is we're is we're not going to play Invader right until there. we finish this box. Yes, that, that we have it. It's ready to go. We've got Sean is currently painting the pieces. Right, Sean? 
Uh, we have pieces in the works. Invader. We have Invader in all the expansions right here. It is right here. We have. I have stuff here. I have a box of stuff over there. Invader's ready to go, Scatterbrains. Yeah. I think we have everything for Invader. Um, so it's going to be super sick when we get yeah. to Invader. Yes, yeah, so that's why we're pushing. ten quests in this Friends and Foes box, and as soon as we're done with this, then we'll, then we'll hit Invader. Yeah. All right, so here we go. We're going to pop this X, dude. Can't wait, though. One time. But one uh, time. This, if Scatterbrains, have you, uh, have you had a chance <gasps> oh, to Oh, dude, it's the green like X it? again, dude. What are the odds? <laughs> yes! Yes! Yes, we're the greatest. We are the greatest. <laughs> <laughs> too easy too easy nice. this game nice nice too easy what what do you have to say hooch should we should we bring hooch in for this yes Yo, good, job. Hooch. good job good job yeah hooch. yeah avenge me. avenge me avenge me avenge me avenge <laughs> me you will be my hero sir you'll be my hero sir yes no problem Hold stream is hooch. Hooch! Do it for hooch! 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 That's kind of a hooch. This just got hooched. One more time. Oh, they're very quiet. Okay, we did it though. We did it for hooch, dude. We did it. We are amazing. Hooch. Settle down, hooch. Rigged. Someone's going to die now. I know. We did this before. I know, no, no, no. Yeah, EDD's right. We can't celebrate too early. That's right, it was a crit. Even though we just did like the biggest celebration ever. <laughs> too bad. Right, we we get, deserve you get it. Five dude. XP. And I get five XP, right? Um yep. but and we don't do anything. We don't even trigger that other spawn because we're awesome. No. And then we search and I get a short bow. Oh dude, nice. Now you got you got double. I got dually got short bows. Short Great. Bows for no reason. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> what she does, she pulls them both back with both hands, and then the bows just go flying. <laughs> Guys, check it out. Double short bows. <laughs> I play the opening mission zero, says Scatterbrains. It's a great time and more streamlined. You can focus fire, so that makes things a little bit easier to take down if you don't have heavy hitting weapons. Exactly. It's what we've heard about Invader, Scatterbrains. Yeah, and yeah, like yeah. Splitting's I, I, better. Yeah, everyone's telling me it's like the, the rule set got, got better. Yeah, that's what everyone says. We, we're sick of the splitting. We're sick of hedges. We're sick of all that stuff, Scatterbrains. So it's going to be so nice playing some uh, zombies in it'll, space. It'll feel like a quality of life improvement for sure. Yeah, man. It's going to be great. Okay, La, your turn. Speaking of quality of life, yeah. I mean, they did that for the, the modern, right? The uh, the two point yep. stream Se on the Okay, here we here go. Too. After Invader, we'll play that again. <laughs> All right. Well, we don't need to open that other door. Um, we got the X, but I do want to go in there and search. That's right. Uh, because I'm gonna do that with, yeah. Actually, no, no. Don't start with him. Okay. Let's start with um, let's start with like uh, Ulfo. You could have my X. Yeah. He's gonna go in and search. Goes in, throws up the search. Longbow. We're getting longbow. all the bows today, dude. Okay, all the he's bows. He's gonna give that longbow to. Uh, let me trade this longbow to uh, Genevieve. Genevieve. For short bow. Yeah, for short bow, dude. Here, go, man. Here's Thanks. a shorter bow. Look at that. I'm gonna give my uh, my extra action to uh, to Cabral, dude. Cabral. Yeah. Okay. Right. Game Elise is gonna go in and search. Go in searches. Oh, gets a crossbow. Gets dude. a crossbow. I'm gonna trade this to Genevieve. <laughs> this is the search for Genevieve. Or a short bow. <laughs> Here, I'll give you a short bow. Yep. Yay! Oh, that's my middle. Oh, actually, no. Wait, no, no, no. You, oh, you have menace. Can, do you want to keep the short bow? Wait, what the heck? Where's the? Oh, wait. What? How did you get mana blast? Crossbow go. Where did the crossbow go? The heck? What the heck? Don't you have a crossbow? Yeah, you have a crossbow. Well, well, I was supposed to get the crossbow from the from the search. Yeah, what the? Weird. It like I must have hit something. All right, equipment, find card, uh, ranged, uh, crossbow. There you go. Because you had mana blast originally. Yeah. Okay. So there's the crossbow. Let's give it over here to Genevieve. Did I give it to someone else on accident? I don't know. Crossbow. Did yep. I give it to Ulfo? No. No. What the heck? If one of our guys accidentally ends up with a crossbow, we know why. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Tension. There's that. Um, all right. Um, session it? says my favorite invader thing is that spawn cards are all the same type. No more two walkers at blue, but three runners at yellow. Oh, cool. Oh, nice. That is nice. 
almost died in mission zero. There's awesome tension, says Scatterbones. Played it with my two sons and got pretty close to the end. We were basically getting chased by a mob and desperately searching for an oxygen tank to leave the base. Oh, great. That reminds me of Modern when we were like, uh, we got to find the gasoline. And we just yeah. <laughs> hold up. We don't have any gasoline. Um, that's awesome. No, we're looking forward to it, Scatterbrains. And, uh, Gamer yeah, Dads. Scatterbrains. That sounds awesome. That sounds Hell yeah. Really game, great. Welcome to the ga Gamer Dads uh, Club, Scatterbrains. Gamer Dads. Tabletop is also Gamer Dad. Uh, right. Okay, so, cool. So Dame Elise is in. Uh, yeah, you're in with me. In That's there. Okay, cool. Done. So uh, Cabral's going to take his free action to move in. in. He's going to search. Searches. Boop. Great sword. Oh, great sword. Finally got some swords. All right, let's equip that. And uh, let's uh, go out and up. Oh. So west and north. Take the point. Yeah. Uh, we just left Lucas out here, like, without anything because he's bad. I mean, I guess you could give him like a. You could give Lucas the great sword if you want. Oh, I could give Lucas the great sword. You want the great sword, dude? I mean, then then I don't have to like push up. I guess then I don't have to go search. I can yeah, use my actions to move up. Well, how I about mean, I give you? Uh, do you want the hammer instead? <laughs> uh, the hammer does two damage. The great sword does not. Do you care about that? Oh yeah, yeah. All right, you can get the great sword. I, I want to hold on to the hammer. I want to be able to kill fatties. I mean, I already have it there. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Yes. So so then he's standing with Lucas then. Yeah. <clears throat> Look at all the noise. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Lucas right. is just like, oh, hey, man, thanks, yeah. guys. Thanks. Thank your whole entire team for uh, searching for my whole entire team. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I can't wait to. Yeah, I was just going to say that tabletop. Yeah, the gasolina. Um, I can't wait to. Man, I haven't heard that in so long. Uh, but yeah, I can't wait to play it with my son. Avery really wants to play this game, but I think uh, it's a little too. Like, Avery gets really focused on things, and I have to be careful with, like, weapons and guns and like stuff like that and i'm oh, afraid yeah. he'll be too i mean a green horde is more like swords and hammers and stuff so that's better but it's the idea of killing that he gets too focused on and gets too like oh god and he's gonna go to school and be like dude you're sitting there killing all this stuff and his kid his yeah. parent, like teacher's gonna be like what are you talking about killing stuff um, yeah but he's only six so maybe in a little yeah. bit here maybe soon all right uh there's no zombies to move that was easy all right zombie spawn let's start up in the middle yep middle oh necro right off the bat Yo, necromancer, necromancer right off the bat where is it where's my song i don't know where my song is there it is so he's coming in all right we got spawn is spawn from tabletop plastic that's painted right oh, there extra activation so extra activation miss Woo. we're not playing with anybody with zombie link so boo no all right uh next spawn why did i clamp can't close out of that let's go on Spectral Waka. Spectral Waka Waka Waka. Okay. That's not though. It's a ghost Waka. And another Spectral Waka, dude. Here's a question with this Necromancer. Um, the closest spawn is actually the blue spawn, but it's not it. active. So does that mean he doesn't go for it? I would assume so, yeah. That it's not an active okay. spawn. So he's going to go to the one all the way to the east. Yeah, it's not an active spawn until we grab the blue X. Oldest one's getting too cool for school, says Sean. <laughs> Same with Sean. That, that's, why the, that's why the command is in chat. Sean. That's why the command's there. We'll allow it. You want your pieces painted by Night, Sean? Night, Nightbot has allowed it. <laughs> Nightbot has allowed it. All right. Um, here we go. Get rid of all this. And, uh, all right, dude. It's your turn okay. first. Yep. I'm going to give... I'm going to start with Ulfo. He's going to do a search. Dude, look at the efficiency of this. Heavy sword, Heavy dude. sword. Oh. Okay. That thing's... Let's put that... Uh, let's let's equip that. Yeah. Swords and bows, dude. Uh, we are going to... Oh, sorry. Then go uh, west, north, and then give our free action to Dame Elisa. Okay. Boop. All right, let's do Dame Elisa. Search. Um... Should I search or should I just? I don't know. Yeah, let's search. You got a free action. Yep. Ding. Great sword, dude. Great swords sword. and bows. Okay. Who's, who shuffled let's this? Let's put deck? the mana blast in the back pocket. Who shuffled this deck? Man? Actually, no. Let's put I the short bow in the back pocket because yeah, it's spectacles. Say. Yeah. Great sword. Okay. Shwing. Great sword, and then go uh, west, north, and then into the water. West. Into the water. First in. First in. Yep. First in. First in. Water's fine. Water's fun. First in. Guys, it's fun. Yep. Uh, Cabral is going to go north. Yep. 
west. That kind oh, of sucks. Second in, burn, second in. Burn in action. Huh? What do I do? My, what does what does Dame Lisa have in her back pocket? Yep. I'll take that. I'll take that short bow. Short bow. Took a brawl yeah. with his last action. Give me that short bow. He says, "Don't." All right. Ah, yeah. it's a tarp. Uh, what should I do with it? it's a tarp? Uh, maybe I should just start with Lucas here. And... Yeah, uh, Bill, she can't equip the sword in the free slot because she has a great sword. It's yeah. different than a regular sword. Yeah, yeah. She's, too, she's not strong enough to carry the great sword in her in her middle slot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> yeah, uh, we, we also have modern version 2 coming here, Fat Lazy Slug, yeah. I'm looking forward to the, the changes. We're going to get all the stuff. All my modern stuff is still over there in boxes. Now it's just going to be another box of modern on top of modern. It's going to just yep. like my rum and bone stuff is on top of my yep. rum and bone stuff. Modern, <laughs> modern on modern. It's yep. just, dude, it's exactly like rum and bones. I could literally have a bookshelf that includes season one of Zombicide Modern and rum and bones, and then the top shelves are season two of rum and bones. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when people come over, I'm like, you want to play the old rule sets or do you want to play the newest rule sets? You would never play the old rule set of rum and bones. <laughs> I know. Never again. Ever. Never again. Um, all right. So Lucas is going to give his extra action to, I don't know. Burnbauer. Yeah. Uh, cool. And then he's just going to move, dude. He's going to go one, two, and jump in. That's water's good. Yeah. Yep. Uh, hey, guys, you got anything else I can take? <laughs> Nothing can be dual wielded, right? Uh, uh, only the short swords, but I think we're all. Yeah, we both. Great swords can't be duly wielded. Yeah, we're good. Yeah. Lucas just playing. He uh, plays in the water. Splash, 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 splash. Yeah, splash, splash, splash. Liam Neeson jumps in the water. Has a good time. Burnbauer's going to search with his free action. Such. Ooh, invisibility. Ooh, invisibility. Once per turn, the targeted survivor benefits from the rotten uh, skills effects until the game around. If he attacks or makes a noise, the enchantment's canceled. So, uh, rotten, rotten uh, is basically you get ignored by zombies for that round. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Invisibility. I'll put it right here. Why not? Seems like something Burnbauer would have. Like, oh, yeah. Man, you're now invisible. <laughs> Blah, 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 blah. He's our new magic man, dude. He's our new magic man. And what's weird is he's in this game. He came from Black Plague. Did was he in Black Plague? That no, you said this is was... a Green Horde promo. So why does he have a gun? I don't because he's I don't know. We don't have any guns in Green Horde. There's Burn, no Burn guns. Power. There's no guns. So yeah. he's magic magic gun man, I guess. <laughs> yeah. All right. So then he's gonna go one, two, and jump in the water because I'm a fish. I'm a fish. Yeah. I'm a fish, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then Genevieve, should she search? One, one, two, three. Or should she just come along? She's got a crossbow, dude. I'm just gonna she's come good, along. She's good, dude. I'm not she's, got, she's got the weapon she needs. She's one, lord two, out. She's got, uh, she's got the weapon Session says, my aunt says, if I, if one more new game enters the house, he has to move out. And his <laughs> response was, define new. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's a new version of a new game. Just like Tim yeah. Tim. <laughs> or that yeah, new Tim Pokemon Tim. game. Puts that stinky fish smell on him. Yeah, exactly. He puts that stinky fish smell on him. Good call, dude. He he get, yeah. he grabs a uh, dead fish, Bean Boozle Bean. Yeah, he goes, here, have this. And they eat the Dean Boon Boozle Bean, and they're like, oh, <laughs> it's not peach. <laughs> or it's not, what's what's the good side of dead fish? Strawberry banana smoothie. <laughs> Strawberry banana smoothie, yeah. All right, zombies. Uh, oh, something mm. Okay, they move up. Yep. Zombie time. Up two up the north there. We got Spectral Walker. We got a Spectral. Your rats be scared since okay, I we do a Necromancer spawn up there. Another so spectral. spectral. Okay. Double Spectral. Two more. Next. Fatty. Fatty. Jeez, we're getting a lot of Spectrals, man. <laughs> is that toxic? <laughs> or not not toxic, it's a uh what is it? Is oh orc toxic? uh these are toxic? No, we haven't played with toxic fatties in no, forever. No, tainted. Tainted, yeah, tainted. Yeah, tainted. Thing. Sorry. <laughs> or no, tainted or is it tainted? Yeah, whatever it is. Yeah, tainted. So that's that's black yeah, it's the green horde fatties. Whatever they were. Um Runner Hi. Okay. Let's just Let's just get one of everybody in there. Yeah, okay. <laughs> all the flavors. All the flavors on the board. Yeah. Alright, boop. Still nothing in the You're horde, up. dude. All right, I'm up. I'm up. All right, so we're just we're just moving, dude. We got to kill this uh, necro though, and I think yeah. this is a well, job. Well, you, you for... can if you move over with Burnbauer. Yeah, this is a job for Burnbauer. But Lucas yeah. is gonna go first. Activate. Beep 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 boop beep yep. boop boop. Um, he's gonna go splishy splash and move one. Yep. 
to there. And then Splash. he's gonna give his extra action. Bone Bala. Burn power. Bone Bala. This action yeah. is yours. This action is yours. And then Burn is gonna make that move. He's gonna go one, two, or one, two, yeah. And go yep. Splash him a fish. And then he's gonna go one, or one action to use Lightning Ball. Yep, to the north, to, to the, the Necromancer. North at this Necromancer. Take this, this is very dangerous to shoot lightning in the water. A miss, dude. A miss. Wow. A rare Burnbauer miss. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Good thing I gave him that extra action, dude. Yeah. Try one time. One time? What? Wow. That's two misses. That's okay. Genevieve has one shot at this. Yeah, Genevieve. Crossbow. My team bad today, dude. My team <clears> can't <throat> search. My team can't uh, open doors. My team can't hit stuff. So yeah. one, two crossbow this guy and then crossbow one to two okay let's do this thing bow bow shot right here lyle ready yeah i should just longboat him dude what was wow. thinking yeah, what was i thinking it. you could have just longboat it yeah you're right I wow just longboat it yeah bill oh. says you're not supposed to play with lightning in the water <laughs> yeah exactly it's true yeah crit nose guys crit yeah. nose safety first you know what happens to a toad when it's not okay. no. <laughs> i was just funny i was talking to avery yesterday and he, uh he went shopping with uh, Rebecca or whatever, and they're at the store, and he helped some lady get oranges. Um, or no, he went to go get oranges, and he was like, yeah, I just asked somebody because I like to meet people. And he's like, I just go up to him and say, hi, my name's Avery. And they're like, okay. And he does that. He does. Just go up to random people like strangers. And I'm like, dude, you gotta be careful around strangers. He's like, why? I was like, well, I was like, if you're at a store, I was like, that was nice, but I was like, first you should ask, make sure mommy's with you if you're gonna do that or whatever. And he's like, yeah. Uh, he's like, well, I was like, so let me test you. I was like, if you're at a store, and someone comes up to you, and they're like, hey, can you come with me and help me get the oranges? What do you say to them? And he goes, uh, please? <laughs> and I was like, no. He's like, thank you? <laughs> I was oh, like, God, no. he's just going through all the magic words. <laughs> yeah, I was like, no. You say, let me get my mommy. He's like, why? He's like, if they're nice, I'll just go with them. I was like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Because nowadays in schools, like back when we were growing up, it was like stranger danger was like a big thing. You remember that? Like, yeah, I remember stranger never danger. Never talk dude. with strangers, yeah. never do this. It was like every day it felt like when you're in young kids' school. I remember them always saying, yeah. like, the candy guy's going to come up and say, get in my van. There's lots of candy and a switch yeah. in there. So, was, yeah, there was always, there was always, <laughs> when we were growing up, there was always a man with a van. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that was like that was a big thing. And they're gonna pick you up like, from don't school. Don't go into that white yeah. van. So it's like, <laughs> I, like, and I asked, I was like, do they talk about this at school? And he's like, I don't know, it's not really. They used to. I was like, what? I was like, dude, watch out for the kids, man. They're not being taught how to watch out for strangers, dude. Strangers are the real threat. Yeah. yeah. Does the nice man have a puppy? Because they, yeah. I guess, I guess, I guess now they're just like, well, these kids aren't gonna be uh, hanging out uh, in real life. Now, now it's all like. Make sure that you have your privacy settings on. Yeah, exactly. Crit Amber Alert. That's right. <laughs> Remember to turn off notifications. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Remember, remember, turn your cell phone off so you can't be tracked. Huh? Yeah, you don't want to waste your battery. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it's kind of true, Zeshin. I think I think some people assume everyone's got cell phones now. And I mean, I'm sure it's helped a lot because everyone's got cell phones. Everyone's got video cameras going. There's cameras everywhere. So, yeah. yes, that has helped dramatically, I think, with... Um, with like you know stranger stuff because like if someone tries to pull something they can easily be caught right there's this idea that like the cops can be easily called by someone standing there if someone's no if someone witnesses something right yeah but like dude it's still a it's still like a threat though like especially around here i mean it's crazy be careful talk to your kids <laughs> make sure they're not like my kid and too friendly make sure your kids aren't friendly <laughs> that's what oh, i'm trying to say because i told my wife i told great, rebecca i was great, like yeah great crit camp lesson yeah i was like kids are too friendly Kids are being <laughs> taught to be too nice. <laughs> uh, let, let, let them keep the innocence. <laughs> no innocence. No more innocence, guys. Innocence. Before they get to the point where they go, hey, everybody. Yeah. Just innocence leave me alone. Flawed. Innocence That's is flawed. That's why we're in my room. Stay I'm at home. Gonna, I'm just going to listen games to the on cure. The yeah. Yeah. I'm going to listen to My game. Chemical Romance. <laughs> no, they didn't even listen to that anymore. <laughs> I'm going to stream My Chemical Romance. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Your turn, dude. Awesome. All right, um, where where am I here? Um, you're all over the place. You're in the water. Oh, Ulfo is not in the water, right? Or someone can come over and take try to kill off this necro before. I mean, I'll have one more shot at it next round. He's not really going anywhere unless we spawn another necromancer. Okay, so let's do uh, let's then do he'll... Ulfo. Then he actually he's gonna he move be... uh, west and then in the water west west. Uh, two actions for yeah. Oh, you jump in the water Boom. and then go. So you splash yeah, and then, and then move into the water. Yeah. 
Boom. Oh, splashy splash. And he's gonna give uh he's gonna give a free action to You want someone to take a shot at uh well I guess they'd get one shot if they took like the longbow or something. You don't have anyone with like Yeah, what 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 do they got? That's zero to one. Blast, blast. And the other guy's zero got a short one. bow. Yeah. Um yeah, I'll give the I'll give it to uh to Dame Elisa, the extra action. Okay. She'll take the longbow and take a shot. Okay. All right, so she's going to go. She's going to move over for two. Oh, hold on. Oh, dang it. Hold on. Yeah. Have, uh, intern. Okay. Dame Elisa. All right. Yep. Doosh. Move over for two. Okay. Yep. Ooh. So the free action and one. She's going to take the longbow. Let's see you take a shot. Yeah. So this is like the two ladies in our party are all mad at each other. Uh, do you want the mana blast or do you want to just me? I don't know. Just do it like this for now. Okay. Why not? There you go. It's like, oh, you think you're better than me? You think you're better yeah. than me with this bow? You think you can take shoot, my longbow and take bow, a shot? Dude. Okay, whatever. Shoot Go, shoot it. Shoot it. Shoot it. Go, try. Shoot But you can't hit it. You won't. Boom, <laughs> critted it, dude. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. Genevieve's like, yeah. What was that? What was what was the movie where um people were snipers and then like they're out in the winter or whatever and he's just sitting there and he's just like, I put the ice into my mouth. I take breath, uh, like a deep breath. Is it the the, the professional? It's not I the forget professional, what it's called, it? Because he like didn't talk at all, did he? Yeah, I don't know. I think there are more help. Oh, enemy at the gate, yeah. Enemy, enemy at the gate. gate. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I remember like, that well, quote. <laughs> enemy at the gate's nice. I can always count. I can always count on chat to know exactly yeah, what it is Bill. for like what quote. <laughs> Bill too. He would he would know. He plays too much Escape from Tarkov. It's like I put the snow into my mouth to <laughs> hide my breath. Yeah. <laughs> That's, this, that's how I assume Bill plays Escape from Tarkov. Like, <laughs> I put the snow in my mouth before I take the shot, and then I I don't... I, I, I kill the scav, and then I don't loot him until I know that everybody else is dead, and I have to make no noise. Yeah. Um, Sean says, I think there are more helicopter parents as well, so they don't talk to their kids about dangers. Hmm. It was like growing oh, up, the idea of there. sending your kid out and not seeing them until sundown is crazy nowadays. No, that's true. No, you're right. And it's illegal. You can't leave your kid in your car without you in it. You're busted. Your kids don't walk home from school. Oh, no, no, but like, I was like... They don't even yeah, do that. I mean, I mean, so there's like that, like when we were kids, it was like, oh, we get to pick a like when the light, when the when the street lights come on, it's just like you had like like thirty minutes, right? Yeah, <laughs> to well, get home. Basically. But now, so that's street true. lights go on, it's just like you gotta get home. Times have changed. Like, oh, great. Now I gotta, I gotta start going home. <laughs> yep. Times have changed. You're right. You're right. All right. So which spawn do we want to get rid of? We don't need to get rid of the blue spawn. Oh wait, no, no. I still have a, a Cabral to go. So he's just gonna go move over. Yeah, but you two. killed the necro. So what spawn do we want to get rid of? Oh, just the one in the north, I guess. Probably this one. Yeah. Let's get rid of that one. Yeah, because we don't have to worry about the blue spawn. <laughs> yep, yep. All right, what do you want to do with Cabral? Uh, Cabral is just going to move over. Yeah. You want to... Oh, no, you can't do a trade to give me my longbow back. Uh, uh, Genevieve's mad you took her longbow oh, and showed her up. Oh, I can't do a trade. I'm going to trade... Uh... Do you want something do you else? Want, do you want the short bow with Genevieve instead of the mana blast, or...? Well, doesn't this range apply to Mana Blast, too? No, that's magic. It doesn't apply to magic? I thought we... Oh, no, that who who were we using? Doran or something? Yeah. What? I thought I thought we were saying plus one damage to ranged. Combat. Doran has plus one damage or plus one dice roll to... Who had magic. plus one damage to magic? Didn't, didn't we have someone that had plus one damage to magic or something? Yeah, and that... Uh... Or was it plus one die to range that we had with somebody? Who, what was Doran's ability? It's like... Why am I? I don't it's plus one magic something. Was it dice? It was dice. It wasn't. Was it dice or damage? I think it was dice. I think it was dice. Yeah. All right. No, I'm good. Okay. Oh, but you're saying I would get the damage with the short bow. Yeah, you would get. Yeah. Whatever. If I need to get the long bow, we're going to stick together, I think, from here on out okay. anyway. It's not a big deal. Intern. <laughs> Zombies. <clears throat> Yeah. Forgot they split over there. Ugh. 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 All right. Uh, to the north with the zombie spawn. Nope. Not playing with foul land. The feral dragon. Nope. Walkers. Walkers. Walker, 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 walker. Bing. Bing. Top right. Vault Warden's coming in, dude. This is a bomb. Oh, yeah. That's right. We're playing with this guy, but nothing in sight. Nothing in sight. Nothing in sight because we're still in blue. So one more spawn. One more spawn. 
and it's another miss, dude. Oh, miss, dude. I like it. I like it. Get these act activation Sweet, cards out of here. It's awesome. All right. Yeah. Burn bomb. Burn bomb. As Sean said. Right, Wolfo Jeweler. is going to uh, start. He's going to go south uh, for two. You can have. And then he's going to give an extra action to Dame Melissa. Okay. That's fine. Um. All right. Bill, can you move the camera? Bill. Because we don't need Hello? to know really what's going on over there. All right. Thanks, Bill. Thanks. Rigged. <laughs> That's it. Uh, okay. Cabral's uh, just gonna go. Cabral's just gonna go two down. Cabral moves two down. Uh, I'm down for two actions. I mean, yep. Okay. Doosh. Doosh. So you could actually shoot these spectrals. No, you can't. You no, I can't. Magic. for spectrals. I can shoot one walker though. So I'm gonna oh, shoot. But if you don't, you could move two spots. Ooh, I can move two spots. Maybe we should do that. Move two spots, dude. Yeah. yeah. Use all your actions. Yeah. You right. You right. That's why we. That's why we did our double. This is why we did it. This is why yeah, we did it. That's we why we got born leaders. Strat. We're not. We're not gonna. We're gonna not gonna yeah. throw out the plan, dude. We're gonna stick yeah. to the plan. We well, Burnbauer can can actually take some take take some dudes from where he stands. Oh yeah, dude. Burnbauer demand. But I'm not gonna start with him. I'll start with Lucas. Oh yeah, that's right. That's right. Because Burnbauer sucks and he's gonna miss. <laughs> so Lucas is gonna go one two down. And then he's going to give his action to Burnbauer. Yeah. Boop. All right. Now we'll have Burnbauer. Uh, yeah, Zeshin, I'm sorry if you said this already. Uh, the plus one to rate, the plus X to range applies to range and magic. So garbage. All right, try another shot. Like, Come this on. spell is so slippery in these fingers. <laughs> <laughs> these fish fingers. I don't have fingers. I'm a fish. Ah, I got one. <laughs> Yeah, it's so slippery in my fish fingers. <laughs> yeah, I'd say I think you just move. Yeah, now I move. I got one. Yeah. Good job, Burnbauer. What do we pay you for? Just to make noise in this water. Yeah. All right, and then Genevieve uh, can't kill them, so she's just gonna move. Yeah. Because Mana Blast is weak. Yeah. Yeah, Mana Blast is a little weak sauce. <laughs> it's no lightning ball, I'll tell you that. All right, zombies. All right, zombies. zombies. Split. Oh my gosh, you're right. That sucks. That guy splits. God, splitting in water, dude. It's those, just, it's just, it hurts so bad. To those Invader fans out there, remember this? <laughs> don't miss this, do you? Yeah, don't, don't miss this. All right, zombies to the north. Bomb to right. No. Oh, Queen Severa, that's good, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's that's, that's in. good. That's in. That's the one we're playing with. So normal Necromancer rules plus may perform a range zombie attack range zero to three damage one targeting the zone with the most uh, survivors in line of sight. So she basically got a long bow. Yeah, she basically gets a long bow fatty. Yeah. Fatty with her. All right, top right. Tainted Walker. There we go. Tainted, tainted love. Walker, we're filling up the horde now. Okay, one more. Oh, no, that's wrong. Those are wrong walkers. These ones. Yeah, there you go. Tainted. And then Spectral Good Walker. Spectral. Dude, so many Spectrals. Yeah, this game's all about the Spectrals. Yeah, dude. Kind of minimal on the rats, but you know what I mean? Yeah. Spectorals, dude. Bill, the intern, got promoted. Is now Bill. <laughs> now he's the intern still. No, he's still, yeah. Yeah. All right, so... Gotta, he's got to prove himself, dude. Yeah, he's got to prove himself. All right, so we got these runners, dude, that are going to... Yeah. We need to start moving. And then yeah, they'll run into move. range. I think way. you can take... You can, well... They'll move into range. Bauer, you can take, basically, a shot and move. Uh, oh, yeah, you can do Lucas with the board leader. Lucas is going to go one, two. Yeah. Yeah. Um, in that turn. And then he's going to give his uh, thing to Burnbauer. Yeah, to Burnbauer. In the turn. So Burnbauer could, yeah, Lightning Ball. Well, oh, yeah, I could take this, the Spectral and the Runner out, right? Yeah, you can take the Spectral and the Runner so out. So my free action, good. let's take a Lightning Ball shot up to the north. 
Finally, dude. Finally. Yes. Got him. Jeez. He's locking it in, dude. He's locking it in. Okay. Now nothing in range, so. Yeah, I run. Swim. Just keep on swimming. Uh, enter. Genevieve, uh, can't hit anything because you can't shoot off an angle. Yep. One, two. Can't curve bullets. Can't curve bullets. Not wanted yet. We haven't gotten wanted rules yet. That's invader. Yeah. I hope. Yeah. We I hope we train. get wanted rules. Wanted rules Listen, and invader. We didn't. We didn't train with Angelina and Jolie yet. Well, we kind so. of get wanted rules when you have the flying cat thing. You kind of had that when we found that familiar. That was kind of like wanted, but not curve. Yeah, it just gives you extra line of sight. It doesn't let you curve yeah. bullets. You see so. over buildings though, so you kind of yeah, can curve like this. Yeah. Right, your turn, dude. Um. Let's start with uh, my dude with born leader. <laughs> Olfo, you could have my axe. Yeah. Uh, Olfo's gonna give it to Cabral, huh? and then move down. One two. All right. In the turn. In the turn, Cabral is gonna move two, uh, south and then west. Splashy splash. Okay. Ding, ding, ding. And then uh, Dame Elisa. Has nothing in range. Just so out of range. Quest. Those are regular yeah. walkers up there, but yeah. Yeah. Just out of range. Look at this. All right. Yeah. We're pretty much we're we're basically back to where we were last week. Yeah. <laughs> we're basically where we were last week. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we got two runners coming over here. Oh, those runners, man. Right. Walkers. Uh, moves up. It's one to three, right? So we're still out of range. Yeah, we're still out of range. Uh, moves up there. All right, so this guy splits. Yep. This guy moves over. This guy splits. Yep. Moves, moves, moves. Ugh. Yeah. Four Split. spawns. Four spawns? Nope. 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 Rats are back, dude. Rats are Rats. back. Guess who's back? Rats back are again. Back. Rats are back. Swarm of rats. Stupid rats. All right. One, two. One more up there. Spectral, Spectral. Walker. Jeez, man. Two more spawns. Top right, another spectral walker. Another dude. spectral. Jeez. And then? No. What a ghostly mission. Oh, that's not a spawn. Oh, that rats? Was a tap. No, that wasn't rats. That's just runner. I tapped the old card. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> cool. Yeah, see, there's okay. no rats. Dang. Dang dogs, dang. All right, so it's your turn. It's my turn. Uh, I'll start with Ulfo. You're first. Um, I'm going to take one shot north and then move over to the west. Takes one shot north. Nah. Got him. All right, got one. I'm going to move to the west. I'm going to give my extra action to... Um, should I give it to one of your guys? Um... Uh, maybe give it to. Well, who's gonna shoot up there? I mean, or actually, let me give it to. Let me give it to. Um, Burnbauer, because we could give him both an extra action, giving him five actions if we want him to. But it's not zero to three. You know what? I'm gonna give it to. I'm just gonna give it to Cabral because he's gonna do a zombie check over this hedge. Oh, that's right. We have the hedge right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Give it to Cabral. Hedge to the east or yeah. west. Oh, west. to the west. Yeah. To the west. Uh, Bill, what are you yeah. doing, dude? Okay. I see what you're doing, Bill. I see what you're doing. You're going to give it to who? Cabral. Uh, Cabral. Okay, Cabral's got it. All right, you want to do Cabral's turn now? Um, or should I give it to Dame Elisa because she's got the great sword? Give it to the Dame, sorry. Okay. And then I'll go, and I'll do Dame right now. Bing. Activate. So, one, two, three, four. Jumps over. Zombie check. Uh, we'll do it with the longbow. One time, no zombie. No, oh, it's a zombie. Ah. So that's only uh, that's my free action and one action. So I have two more actions left. With her? Oh, you yeah. were right there. Oh, yep. you were right there. So yeah, free action. So yeah, okay, you're good. Good call. Yeah. I thought and you now were I'm gonna swing away. the great sword. Swings the great sword. Whoops. Swing. Goes for it. Gets him with the crew. Great. Stack dice. Okay. 
And you have one more action. One try that's doing I mean, I could open the door. Is there. that scary? Maybe. Because what if we get some activations and stuff starts well, rolling? Well, we're in blue. We don't have it's activations, true. but. It's true. It's true. Can I even open doors with this thing? Five plus. <laughs> yeah. And I open up, what, three rooms? Yeah. I spawn three rooms. I mean, the rats, rats would be really scary if I got rats. Yeah, maybe we wait till we are all out of this water here. Okay. Yeah, we got time. 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 All right, that's it. Enter. Uh, Cabral is just going to move over into the hedge. GG. Get prepped up. Prepped. Prep turn. All right, Burnbauer. Who's dealing with these? this runner? Is it Burnbauer who's going to deal with it? Um, let's see. Let's start with Lucas, who isn't doing anything. He's our melee bro. He's going to go one, two. And give this action... Well, I don't want to give it to... i got to see who's going to... Well, you can give it to Genevieve, because it's it's just a regular runner. Yeah, do I give it to Genevieve? Oh, you don't have the short bow anymore, yeah. Well, I'm thinking Genevieve... I'm trying to see who need, who has the least amount of XP. Because Ge who has the... Right, this is 0 to 2. Oh, I don't have the long bow. Oh, yeah, Burnbauer has more XP than... Uh, oh, wait, no, Genevieve does. Genevieve. Jeez. So I'm going to give it to Burnbauer, because he's bad. Okay. So Burnbauer gets the action. Okay. Okay, so Lucas done. Boom, bow, bow. Um, well, actually, actually, you could have given it to Genevieve, so she she moves all the way to the hedge. Burnbauer takes one shot and moves over one. Well, can't we move? Isn't it only one to get out of the water here because it's foam? So, like, Lucas could have walked out of the water. Oh, so I had like two actions left over with my guys. Yeah. So I burned two actions with Dame Lisa and with Cabral. I mean, you could go back there and do something with it, right? Because that's only foam, right? Yeah, Zession's saying it's foam. It's no extra cost. Ah, so Cabral and you have an extra act. Do you want to try to pop the door with her? Maybe pop the door, yeah, because I have so many actions. It's not really changing what I've done so far, so... Yeah, so try to pop the yeah pop the door with the greatsword. Uh, is this a door roll? Yeah, to open the door yeah. one time? Yeah. Gets it, crushes Gets it. it. All right, start from the furthest room. Got to it before before chat did. We got to it before YouTubers. <laughs> start with uh, start in the southwest room. Southwest. Beep. Fatty burster Nothing. miss. All right, west so the north Blackheart, west no. room. Siege breaker no. Bomb and alpha no. Standard ready to fatty. Fatty. Okay. And then the room with the X. The X. Uh nope. Waka. Waka, 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 waka. Not bad. All right, and then I have another action. I'm going to shoot the longbow at this guy. Ah, putting used to that longbow, huh? Yeah. You stole. Aha. Aha. All right, Cabral had two extra, uh, two other actions. So he's going to shoot the short bow. Shoots the short bow. Gets him. Got him. Uh, and then I could actually move in there. Good. Fatty's going to move up, but it's fine. But that's, but that's okay, because we're not going to get any activations, right? Nope. Yeah, move in. Move that. All right. All right, now it's your, now back to your turn. Sorry. Right, back to... Pseudo rewind. Well, I moved over, and then I can move out. Yeah, you can actually move up. Yep. And I gave my action to Burnbauer. Yep. So here, Burnbauer is going to use his lightning ball, or for free. Lightning ball for yeah, free, because we have the action. Fire it. Gets him. Got him. Boop. And then... I can get out, right? Yep. Right, and then I can move two and move one. Yep. Done. He's Boom. Good. Sweet. It's working out. All right, and I can't hit anything with this stuff. No. So I'm so just going to go one, two, three. So Ulfo was the only one who didn't have enough actions. Yeah. Okay, zombies. So Fatty moves over. Uh, move here. No. Actually, Ulfo did have enough actions because he was standing on the spawn. He was here? Yeah. Because how else did he make it over there? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. He didn't fight anything, right? No, he didn't fight anything. Oh, yeah, he did fight something. Sorry, he did shoot something. You're right. He shot something with, he shot a runner with a, with a short bow. Yep. Oh, right, right, right. So he's yeah. there. Um, and in 
that case, too, since you went first, you would have had to check with him. You would have checked the zombie check would have been with him, but it didn't. Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah, you're yeah, right. Um, so then, boop. And boop. Out of range. Boop. They go boop. one, two. Yep, that's correct. Jeffers over. It splits. Yep. Belly roll. All right. Tuck and roll. Four spawns. That necromancer is gonna escape, which sucks. Uh, runner. Runner. Eventually, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, she's gonna go over there somewhere, right? Yeah, she's gonna start moving to the east. He's gonna move faster than her. Yep. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Uh, tainted walker. Waka 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 waka. Tainted. It's a race, man. It's a race. Right? That was it. Yep. We have two more. Okay, two more spawns. Vault Warden. Miss. Woo! Miss. Nice. I like that. And then... Rats. Rats. Okay. Oh, rats. So that means... The other rats don't activate, right? That's only when... The other rats do activate. So the rats always reactivate on rats? Rats Rats always activate on rats, yeah. Okay, so rats are moving. Yeah, so uh, special rules, swarms of rats get extra activation each time a swarm of rats zombie card is drawn. And it's just the extra rat, not the ones you spawn, right? It's just the... No, 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 it's just the ones already on the board, yeah. Okay, so the rats are coming, the rats are coming. <laughs> Here come our favorite thing, the rats. You gotta race the rats, you gotta race. What's up? All right, here we go, you're up. <laughs> Builds a team to deal with rats, hardly get any rats. I know, right? That's how it works. Yeah. That's why they suck, said Session, exactly. I mean, you know, I should know this, being that we've died to them how many times? Yeah, a couple times now. Um, okay, so you've got your bro. I can't kill yeah. him with this, dude. Um, yeah. I can't crossbow in there. I mean, I could. Yeah. <laughs> I'd say just, like, open this door, dude, while we're still in blue. <laughs> can I open doors with zombies in there? Yeah, you can open doors with zombies. All right, why so um, I'm going to move up with Lucas. Move up with Lucas, um, and then I guess, yeah, I'll take a door swing here with the short sword. Better chance okay. to open it, obviously. It's better sword yeah. for door swinging. Whoops. Gets it. Yes. Yeah. Nice. All right. Yeah. All right. So we are spawning four rooms. Well, one, two, three. Not this. Or this one? Yeah, one, two, three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's yeah. not those. There's a wall, so it's not the, the, the upper two. So start from north and go south. Here we go. Right. So four. Uh, yep. Uh, fatty. Fatty. We just can't get two rat spawns. Walker. Take the walker. Waka, 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 waka. Okay, two more. Uh, we're not using Necromancer has a skip. Necromancer, skip. Okay. Uh, dragon, no. Vault Warden, skip. No, we're good. Skip. Woo. Yeah. And then the last one, the X Room. X Room. Uh, it's Queen Severa, that's a skip. Skip. Okay. Bowman Alpha, double spawn. Double spawn to the first, oh, uh, the, the north room. Dang it, we just didn't need rats, dude. We didn't need rats. I know, I know. All right, I know. Fatty Burster, miss. Fatty nice. Burster, okay, nothing. One more spawn. And then miss. Vault with the Warden, Warden. nothing. Woo! Okay. Cool. Dodge some rats, dude. Dodge rats, dude. Rat I dodge. like it. All right, so I've got two actions left. I'm going to give my extra action. Well, you have one action left. You moved up and you opened the door. Oh, yeah, but I mean, I can give an action. Yeah, you can give an action. So, uh, yeah, I'm not going to do anything. I'm going to give the action to... Let's Fatty just is holding things up, dude. Yeah. Like, I could give it to Lucas well, or... Well, you can move past him. If you give somebody an action, they can move past him, I guess. Oh, that's true. I, I was going to say, like, man, it'd be nice if I could get an extra action with Lucas. Yeah. Because he has no XP, but I don't want to... I mean, I guess I have one more XP here. You have one XP. Um. Yeah, I guess you can move past. I guess I give it to... Uh, I'm going to give it to Genevieve. Cause I can't, okay. Then I go one, one, two, and then I can... No, I can't take a shot through the building. No, you can't take a shot. Not interior. Okay, I'm going to give it to Genevieve, though. Whatever. I'm just going to move. Uh, right. Assuming you can handle this. In, yeah. in turn. Um, Yo, what up, Reld? So says give... hello. Work breather. What up, Reld? What's going on, dude? 
So, so one is the free action for her to move up, and then two to move out. Oh, and then I have one more action. Right? Yeah. So one to move up, two to move over, and I still can't shoot that guy up there. Yeah, and you don't want to move up because... I could search. I could you, search. You could search, yeah. I could search. I don't want to grab this X because I don't want to activate the blue. Yeah, yeah. You can <laughs> search. That's fine. Yeah, I'm going to search. Um, how's work today, Reld? How's your day at work? Is it going well? Oh, sword! Sword. Yes. Nice. <laughs> now I have melee. Got lots of swords and bows today. Dude, Reld, I am one. I am 0.3 kilometers away from finally evolving my Phoebus that I've been working on for like six months. <laughs> and I thought, today's the day. Today's the day Phoebus gets evolved. I know. I've been walking with an Onyx for like over 80 kilometers. I've walked with my Onyx. Hold on. For 85 kilometers, and I still have seven candies left to get this boy. Oh, you're trying to get the big Steelix? Yeah, I want to get Steelix. Big yeah. Steelix. Yeah, Phoebus, dude. I'm so sick of my Phoebus. So sick of my Phoebus, man. And then, next, you know what I'm going to switch to after Phoebus, Lyle? You know who my next buddy what? is? What? Clink. Magikarp? No, Clink. I've already done Magikarp. I did that oh, you did? a long time ago. Yeah. I have oh, a, wow. I have a Gyarados. I want to I wanna evolve my Whalmer, but I need 400 candies. <laughs> <laughs> I've done whale. No, I haven't done Whalemer. Whalemer, I haven't done. I did the the floaty cloud arm bird thing. That one's four hundred. Oh, uh, Swablu. Yeah, I whatever. did Swablu. I've got Swablu's done. Wow, that was that's a long that's a long one, dude. Jeez. I got Swablu's done. I got Swablu done. I've done Phoebus before. I did. I did Gyarados. Um, yeah. I haven't done Whalemer though. Oh, you know? dude, lun lunar lunar stuff. Uh, lunar, lunar event news. Uh, there, there's gonna be a red, red shiny Gyarados out there in the wild. Dude. Ooh, that would be cool to get. But that's yeah. probably in raids, not in the wild. You can't just catch a Gyarados in the wild. I don't think. You'd have to be in a raid. You'd have to be in a raid. You gotta oh, start really? doing raids, dude. You gotta start yeah, doing raids. You gotta start doing raids, dude. It's just well, part me, of the me, game. me, have been doing raids because we have to do it for our research events. But um, yeah, raids. We've been doing like the like the low low raids. Yeah, yeah, like, like two maybe three. We, like because we're I'm level twenty four and she's like level twenty. Like we yeah. can't. You can do two star raids. You can do two star raids. Oh yeah. Easily. You could do. How three do I know star. what star it is? It says right under the thing. It has three. It has three oh, like bad okay. dude faces, and it goes Got up it. to five. You can't yeah. do more than three. You might be able to survive do one of those like, join one of those like heat tran, raids. Oh, whatever. that's probably five. Like if it's like you. a really special guy, they're five star raids. But like, yeah, I was like, I was you like, could do I a three know. star raid. I got like, I just like got knocked out. Like it was like one move, like every time with that with the big guy. Yeah, like, yeah. You two could like, easily do a three star raid if you counter what the boss is. Like if you counter, you know what I mean. Like if you're doing like if it's fire, you yeah. go in with your water dudes, right? Yeah. And you could do that. You with well, the two this of you. is your fault. Yeah. <laughs> I just he came in. We just started talking about Pokemon. <laughs> I know you throw. Now it's either Keyforge or Pokemon lately that sends us down a hole. I know. I know. Real, uh, Casey was very excited to to be friends with you. By yeah. the way. Oh, Bill says it's surreal when you go to a raid and there's a ton of people standing around during an event day. I know it's crazy, right? It's weird. You're like everyone's kind of like looks at each other like <clears throat> awkwardly, like you, you guys playing Pokemon? Because everyone's like this. It's like, are you are you in this? <laughs> are you like, hey, yo, what up, Mortavis? You guys, hey, what up, Mortavis? They're like, hey, you guys jump in. Uh, you gonna jump in with us? It's like. Yeah, what time? When are we going? All right, we're going in now. And everyone's like, okay. Uh, what's, what's the code? Snorlax, Snorlax, Pikachu. <laughs> yeah, well, you usually don't have to do that. You, unless you're like a private party, you don't have to do that. Oh. But what up, Mortimus? What up? And, and Bill, are we friends? Are we friends on Pokemon Go? Do you play Pokemon Go, Bill? Are you are you closet Pokemon Goer and haven't friended wait, us? Wait, wait, Bill. Why are you not? Are you? Yeah. Are you? Yeah, you're not my friend. Mortimus, do you Pokemon Go? Why aren't you my friend? Yeah. I well, stopped playing, but do you still have an account? Because I, I need friends for, for a task. <laughs> a lot of people stop playing, Bill, but then they start playing again. That's how it works. I stopped playing yeah. for a while, and now I'm back. Yeah. Stimator says, hey, camp, can't stay sadly. Working on site with clients for a few hours longer. We'll be muting and pinning this tab. Thanks, dude. Just wanted to pass along my Prime again. Oh, oh. Wait, yeah, what up, Stivator? Remember to refresh it. If you pass the Prime our way, Stivator, we really appreciate the man. Your guys' sub support's huge right now. We need some sub support for sure. Yo, Bill, send me a friend code, dude. Put it, put it in the Pokemon Go uh, Discord channel, dude. Or, yeah, do not just do it casual, Bill. Be cash, dude. Take some time out of your EFT rating. When you're waiting for your EFT raid to start, when you're sitting there waiting yeah, and waiting, yeah. then you can play some Pokemon Go. Just check it. Send us some gifts, dude. But thank you so much to Vader, man. There it is. There's his six dice. I don't know why it's not popping. It will. It'll pop soon, Stavater, Vader, and we'll give you your spin for sure, man. Thank you, man. Hope yeah. all's well. Yeah. And Mortavis says, I stopped after they made it so you could get region-locked Pokemons not in those regions. Yeah. And well, I couldn't you can get it from eggs, Mortavis. What, what does that even mean? What does that mean? No, that means, like, you can't get some stuff that's in Asia only. Like I've been saying, you have to get an egg sent to you from Asia to get it. 
Uh, That's what I'm saying. You can't just catch everything everywhere. Like now, it's there's certain Pokemon right, in right, certain areas right, to get you to okay. go there. Well, I only started a month ago, so I I mean I I live only in these rules. <laughs> yeah, but that's cool. That forces you because we have this great community, Mortavis, that you could come in and friend people from all over the country, if not world, right. and get cool stuff. I can give you those very special Nashville eggs. Nashville eggs. <laughs> I'm actually I'm incubating a Nashville egg right now, a seven kilometer Nashville egg, and we'll nice. see what it is. Usually it's garbage, but but yeah, uh, my next some some some, some, of my, some of my good stuff come from Pennsylvania. I like the ones that Rel sent me from from, from Minneapolis. Uh, Minneapolis, dude. Yeah, those are from good. Minnesota. I used to get them from like Sky Jedi. Stuff. He stopped sending them. He's kind of stopped playing, dude. Please on beside now, says Rel. Okay. Well, you know what, Bill? I um, I, I, I totally I, I feel you on that was because when I visited my dad in suburban New Jersey, it was like a Pokemon one, dead one, zone, one, and I was dying. I was like, there's no stops. There's no Pokemon that even like spot here, and I was like, it was bad. <laughs> but at the same time, man. When I went to New York, because when I when I visited my dad, I, I flew into LaGuardia, and I kind of went through Manhattan, you know, to uh, take a bus to to New Jersey, and it's just, I mean, playing Pokemon Go in, in New York is oh, just not, cheating. Oh yeah, it's but, cheating. It, it, so it was cheating. like ten so focus easy. stops, like a block. Did you and raid there was all anything? of this stuff popping everywhere, and I'm yeah. just like, this is straight up cheating. And I was in a I was in a cab going cross town from the west to the east side right and you know that's a that's a crawl and because it's a crawl yeah you're just spinning the app doesn't know that you're in a car and so i'm basically just sitting in the car i'm just spinning stops and catching mm -hmm. like you know all this stuff i was like this is just cheating mm -hmm. absolutely it's nuts. it's nuts it is nuts yeah and it is weird here in pennsylvania you said casey's house is a dead zone or a parent's house is oh a dead god zone. yeah so casey's mom's house and my dad's house pokemon dead zones dude <laughs> no pokemon yeah like, rebecca's yeah i would just have the dead. app open while we're like watching tv or eating dinner or whatever blah 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 like nothing would ever even spawn mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah no same i mean same like, at least the... at least when when i stay with you your neighbor is a nest and oh, so yeah. stuff happens we got the know? nest dude we got the nest like that like all like basically all the shinies i have just minus the, the piplups i just got on a community day like came from like your house <laughs> yeah dude the, like rebecca's in my in-laws house is like dead zone and it's just on the other yeah. side of town there's nothing there dude no yeah. stops no nothing can't even see anything over there yeah oh it's 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 like why would you live in that <laughs> yeah <laughs> i'm seriously gonna sell when i sell this house if i sell this house anytime soon and pokemon go still a thing i'm totally advertising that it's next door to a poke uh a nest my neighbor's <laughs> house has way more value than my house because of that i'm like dang it <laughs> dang it like yeah. <laughs> and that's and if people come to see the house i'm gonna tell the realtor when you walk up to the guest room above the garage you tell them that you have easy access to the nest from this room. Yeah. It was pretty great. And dude, it'll sell the house, dude. It'll sell yeah, the house. Um, all right, dude, your turn. All right. Where are we? Uh, what are we doing? <laughs> Rails? Rails? <laughs> all right. Let's start with Ulfo. Ulfo. You yeah. can have my axe. Uh, he's going to give uh, the extra action to uh, Cabral, I guess. Okay. <clears throat> what are you going to do? He's going to go. Uh, he's going to move over west. That's one. Uh, he's gonna move north, and stay. And stay, I guess. I mean, you could have caught up if you'd started with Cabral and then whatever. That's but. true, but I wanted to give him the extra action just in case he needed it for this fatty. Okay. Uh, right, Cabral is gonna go uh, free action, swing the hammer. Hammer time, dude. We haven't hammer timed in a while. Nice. Yeah, hammer time. Little hammer time. Little hammer time. <laughs> Hammer time, hammer time. Got him. Got Ooh. him with the free action. Nice. Okay. Oh yeah, free action. Alright. Yeah. Okay, clear. It's clear. I can, I can go one, two, and take one shot at the tainted, but if I miss No one's gonna have a chance. Hit. Well No, no one would have a chance. Yeah. We have to kill it with range. Right? Or you get tainted yeah. spray. Isn't yeah. that how it works? Yeah. So just it's move over. Dangerous, maybe. though. So I'm going to do a search instead. Ooh, searching right here. Ooh, the Daggler. Ooh, Daggler. Dude, Daggler. Okay. This is, this goes, oh, oh, and that's heavy dagger. Just regular Daggler. I kind of want to keep the hammer and the short bow, though. So I'll just put it in the back pocket, I guess. Okay. It's the other thing. Someone got a heavy sword that has the. Yeah. So you're gonna move uh, over. I can give this dagger to somebody in in my zone or whatever. Yeah, Olfo needs the heavy dagger. Oh right. But you can give it to Olfo if he's not 
shooting any range stuff. And then move over. Because uh, Ulfo's with I like you. How, I like how everybody has range, though. It's nice. All right. I mean, we're just... I'll just keep it like that. And I'll just move over one to the east. Okay. Boop. Yeah. We're not even getting these X's, dude. We're like, <laughs> X's? No. F, F the X's, dude. Yeah. All right. So she's going to move up and search. Ooh, risking the search here. Risking the search. Yeah. Oh, kitty time. Oh, with the bird's eye view. Kitty time. Got your cat back, dude. Cat Gotta catch them all, dude. Is it Vanitas? Yeah. It's Vanitas again. Same cat. Yeah, Same cat. Yeah, Vanna. And then um, <laughs> Sean says, three bedroom, two bath, pool, grade school. <laughs> and next to Pokemon Nest. Boom, mic drop. <laughs> Yeah, dude. <laughs> All right, you got a Vanitas flying cat, and then I assume you just moved over, right? Yeah, I just moved over, yeah. Unless you want to spend your axe and descend your... Oh, I didn't give you the cat again. I messed up. Uh, fine card, familiar, Vanitas, in your pocket. Yep. So with that cat, though, you could send her off. <laughs> you could have sent right, her so off. All right, so tabletop, uh, redeemed. Sean. Spin the wheel. Right. Sean Redeem, spin the wheel. Hype. All right, spin the wheel for him, dude. It's a good time. Here we go. It's for you, Sean. To celebrate you getting a flying cat again, Lyle, we're staying uh, pretty. We're staying. Well, I could have I could have put the cat up ahead and to take, to take damage. Yeah, we could sack the cat, dude. But no, we don't sack cats, it's dude. Cat, oh. Okay. One bean. Bean the Lyle. Speaking bean the Lyle. Four, it's a dead fish or strawberry banana smoothie. Oh, so. nice. Speaking of the dead fish smell, burn bomb, burn brown brom. Burn Bauer. Strawberry banana smoothie. Mm. But it has remnants of dead fish in there. So Yummy. Not, not great. That sounds good. I just got a notify of the Pokemon Go live event. Uh, are coming to Taiwan, the US and the UK. Check in app news for more. More events coming, guys. More events. I mean, I could check more right events. now. I could check right now and see if I've gotten my egg due to GPS, like, sway. Like, or whatever it's called. Hold Some... on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to catch this. Now you maybe open it up, and I got to catch okay, this cat. Zombie turn. Really it's zombie turn anyway. While I move the zombies, you can catch. You can Pokemon Go while I move the zombies. So we got grass one, two. I'm okay. trying to get better at my curve balls. It's um. It's important. It's bad. You gotta practice. Okay, one, two. Uh, so this gets is where it gets getting funky. So she's headed. It doesn't matter. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, she's going right here. Okay, so. Give me that candy. They're okay. coming here. She's going. This guy splits here. This guy goes here. This goes here. And then it goes... This guy's going to split again. So this guy goes here. This guy goes here. And then adds one. Yep. Here. And then this splits here. This goes here. These go here. This goes here. Okay. Yep. I didn't do these ones. No. These ones. So this guy... Yeah. Here, here. And then you have to do the interior building here. ones. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Dang. So many things. All right. So there. We caught up. We caught up. Let's see. Let's see. Play zombies. Don't po Pokemon Go later. Oh, says the Pokemon yeah. Go guy. Yeah. Yeah. Bill says, I feel like Pokemon Go is an interesting case study on mobile games, such an addicting gameplay mixed with nostalgic IP. Well, what's funny about it is I don't have any nostalgic IP. Uh, it got the candy. It found the candy. Militic found the famous candy. Nice. Yes, dude. <laughs> Okay, we can all be uh, here for the big moment that I yeah. evolved the stupid Phoebus. Oh my god. But yeah, Bill, I never watched the show and I never played the game, so I don't really have any attachment to Pokemon, but I got addicted anyway. Um, I think it's I think it's really, really Yeah, I understand why it's a big like uh it became as big as it did. Alright. It's addicting. Okay. It's, like, it gives you something to do when you're not doing anything. All my rainbow candies. Yes, look! It can happen. It's going to happen. A hundred candies for my Militic to evolve oh my stupid God, dude. Phoebus into another Militic. Here we go. The moment. Dude, that's crazy. Man. Live on air, dude. Live Pokemon Go stream right here. Now the camera's like, what <laughs> Pokemon are you doing? Pokemon Go stream right now, Pokemon dude. Go stream right here. We're going to go boop. Here we go, guys. Yay. Oh, my God. It's happening. It, it's happening. It's happening. It's happening. This oh, I don't is have so exciting, dude. <laughs> this is so exciting. <laughs> here it is. The moment. It's happening. Help, help. New Militic! Oh. <laughs> there it is. Yo, what's... Oh, 1273. Yo, yo, hit hit that appraise button. I want to see where your IV's at. <laughs> Pretty good. Oh, come on, camera. Oh, come on. Look at that. 
pretty good. Nice, yeah. pretty kinda good, even across Solid. the board. There. Yeah, I think this is better than my other Mulatic. But yes, it's over. <laughs> yes. <laughs> No Do more. Do we get a crit for evolve? Yeah, I'll give you guys crits for the evolve. Oh yeah, crit for the evolve. Crits for the evolve, dude. Crits. I'll give you a lot evolve. of crits for the evolve. Crits for the evolve. <laughs> All right. So now I've got to. Now I can change my body, guys. I am done. I am done. Check it out. This is why I've been trying to do it, dude. Let's go. Over, go over here. This thousand year slumber. I've been sitting on this quest for like. Oh, you can't see it. Oh, right? thousand. Uh, yeah, yeah. All right. I'm gonna get right, this thousand which, year slumber which, uh, quest. Which number of the thousand year slumber are you on? Huh? Number two? Two of, seven. two of seven? Dude, it's been sitting there. Boop. Get yeah. my reward. See, that's the one I need. I need fr I need friends for that one. Um, Good luck evolving a Phoebus, dude. Yeah, oh. I'm on one of seven for Thousand Years Look, Slumber. he needs help. Need a... Thanks for your help, Crit Camp. Your home Pokedex is really looking great. The Wizmer you caught reminded me of a line from the text I told you about. I mentioned that a melody or a sound can awaken a sleeping Pokemon. That gives me an idea. Let's do a little experiment. There's a sleeping Snorlax that hasn't left my lab in months, and it's right in front of Barry something. Oh, think, dude, are you gonna get? Are you gonna catch a Snorlax right now? I already have some Snorlaxes. Think we could wake it up with a loud noise? Let's document the Wizmer evolution line too. Some photos will. Oh, great, Wizmer line. Ugh. I haven't been finding any Wizmer. So my new tasks are take a snapshot of Loudred. Easy. I can do that right now. <laughs> Make three great throws in a row. Easy. Earn three candies walking with your buddy. Easy. Way easier than evolving a freaking Phoebus, dude. I can do dude, this I today. I love it when you get the ones that are super easy. Oh, my gosh. All right. So I'm going to change my buddy, and then we'll go back Just to Pokemon. Just give me the XP. Just so give it to me. The new, the new, uh, the new guy that's going to be my buddy, if you guys are my friend, you guys can friend me up. It's in the Discord. It's going to yeah. be this Clink, That dude. means you, Bill. Clink. Do you have a Clink yet? I do have a clink. I just got a clink. Yeah. Yeah. This is going to be my buddy now, dude. Clink. Yeah. Clink is going to become my new buddy. You're out of here, Phoebus. I don't, or Militic. It's, it's over, dude. I'm over. I'm over you. How do I get rid of you now with all this new things? Uh, swap buddy. <laughs> I'm playing Pokemon Go here. Okay. We're going to get back to the game. <laughs> all right. We're done. We Why just got to spawn. Are we on zombie spawn time? Yeah. Okay. You know, we have to spawn them. Yeah. I'm just doing this so I get. Bye, Militic. Get wrecked. Bye forever. Clink. You're my buddy. Clink, I choose you. Should we... Um, wait, 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 wait. Nice. Before, should I have left the cat in the X room uh, to the west? Because rats are coming up, dude. <laughs> you can't just leave it, can you? Like, how, instead of me moving over... How do you like just leave me, it? The cat would have stayed there. Can you just leave it? Oops. I think it's weird that these gears eat fruit. So <laughs> I'm just watching these gears eat my I fruit. Think, I think me and the cat need to stay back a room. In case we got we get rat spawns? Unless we get, yeah, because we got ratted, dude. You and the cat? I mean, I did zombie moves, but I guess that's an okay change. Yeah. All right, dude. Okay. Okay. When are they going to open up a Pokemon minis game? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Okay, I got to close this, dude. My Clink's wandering around. Oh, me and Clink are now good buddies. <laughs> <laughs> Is there any benefit to actually having, like, doing that stuff with your buddy stuff? Yeah. Like, oh, I yeah. did it one day, and it, it was, like, a lot of work. It takes a know? lot of work. I beat him, like, so many berries. Yeah. And, like, it all takes this a stuff, lot of work. I attacked with him, and, like, I didn't feel like I was getting like, anything good. No, as they level up, they give you, like, bonuses on captures and stuff like that. Like, it'll give you bonuses, so you want to grind it out with them for sure. Are you sure? Yeah, dude, I He's got like... rid of my Phoebus. Yes! That feels so good. <laughs> oh, God, I'm so sick of that stupid Phoebus. All right. Um, so you're going to leave her there? That's what we're going to yeah. do? Okay. All right, so now we're going to do zombie spawns. Zombie spawns to the north. Uh, zombie giant. Necromantic dragon. Walker. Spectral yeah, walker. Spectral walker. There's one. YouTubers were like, I watch this for board games. Who plays freaking uh, Pokemon yeah. Go? Waka, waka, waka. If you were going to play yeah. Pokemon Go on air, why don't you just stream Pokemon Go? Yeah. <laughs> Tainted. Waka, 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 waka. Love YouTube. YouTube, you're great. Last spawn. Yeah, and if you guys haven't subbed to us on YouTube, please go sub to us on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> Be sure you smash that yeah, sub button it, on yeah, YouTube. Uh, yeah, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like. Uh, oh, double spawn. Double spawn to the first spawn. Oh, no. Spectral. Spectral walker. And? Spect two more okay, spectral. So two spectral walkers. Dude, we're getting low on spectral, man. 
that's the problem. Ugh. If we don't deal with them and beat the game soon, they're gonna start. I know. We gotta. We gotta go, dude. We gotta activate. go. We gotta go. Gotta 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 go. All right, man. Your turn. All right. Uh, uh, let's start with Ulfo. Ulfo. Mm -hmm. Hi. Um, he's going to move over and shoot the short bow north. Move over, shoot short bow to the north. Okay. Hopefully kill this dude. Got him with a crit. Got yes. Crit. Oh. Make and then move north. Does that have you two XP or just one? Well, now I have two. Two, okay. Yeah, I only killed two things. Then you're going to move north? Okay. Yep. So I moved, I attacked, I moved north. You can't open with this heavy sword. You cannot open doors. It's kind of weird. And then I'll give a, uh, I'll give an extra action to... Someone that can open doors. <laughs> uh, okay, Cabral. <laughs> Cabral, okay. Yep. Uh, in turn? Is it frozen? Is the iPad frozen? No. Hello? Lyle? Hello? Did we lose Lyle? Oh, no. Google Internet. Google Internet. Wait, you lost me? Are you there? I'm here. No, it's fine. Can you see me moving? I can see you moving. I'm just saying, is the iPad frozen? Because... Why, would, why would it be frozen? It's not doing anything right now. Oh, because you didn't... I was going to say, end, end the turn with Ulfo. Okay. Right now. Oh, okay. There you go. You okay, man? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's like fine. your 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 head like he like snapped into this other reality for a second. No, no, what? no, because I was like, is the iPad frozen? <laughs> no, because we could, okay, because I said I was like, oh, it's the next turn, and usually you're you're like you end the turn, go to the next character, and I was just like, oh, it's the iPad broken. Okay. Mind games, dude. Mind games. Got it. Cabral's gonna move up north with his free action, and then knock on this door with the hammer. And he's gonna knock knock on door with yeah. the hammer, four hammer to roll. Pachoo. Gets it, Got crushes it. the door. Boom. Yeah. Can we open the blue door? Or can we only open the green door? Oh, we can only open the green door. You're right. We can only open the green door. What a waste of time. Take it back. All Rewind. Right. So then move up. <laughs> move up to that stupid guy. And then and then hit him with the hammer. And you got to hit him with the hammer time. Stop. Hammer time. Hammer time. Got him. Right. Got him. Oop. And now open this door. Good try, Lyle. Yeah. Good try and a cheat. I know. I know. Okay, now you're going to get the door. Oh, of course, of course not. not. Yep. All right, Dame Elisa is going to move one, two, three. So east, north, north. With the cat. Bring in the kitty. Brings the kitty cat. Okay. Uh, bow. Uh, I can go up and give it a try. Yeah, I'll, I'll go give it a shot. Actually, I'll I'll do Lucas first. Where's Lucas? Oh, he's way back there. Oh, he's way back. He's, so he's he just one, needs to catch two, up. Three. Yeah. Get out of rat. Yeah, one, two, three. The rat dead yeah. zone. And then give my extra action to. Wait, Burbank. you can't move four. He did. Oh, move three. Yeah, I got it. Move three. Whoa, dude. Yeah. Whoa, dude. Need some coffee, man. <laughs> I do. Need, you know what? You're right. <laughs> you're like losing it, dude. You're you're losing it. Um, I gave my extra action to Burnbauer. So he's going to get go. one, two. And then he's going to try to open this door with his short sword, dude. Come on. One time. Open the door. With his slippery fin hands. Dang it. <laughs> Dang it. Use your little fin hands, dude. Yeah, use your little fin Bill says fingers. I'm distracted with, with Pokemon Go. No, I closed it. I closed it. Yeah, he's too distracted. Pokemon Go, like, snapped your brain, dude. Okay, one time. It did. Yes, door crew. I'm trying to get that catter candy and then. Bill, I think you should get back into it. Yeah, Bill. Totally should get back into it. It's casual. It's a casual game. What up, Heroic Logic? What's going on, man? Good to see you. I owe 40 burpees, and they're probably going to be celebratory burpees here, Heroic, to wrap up everything I owe since the Christmas special. Someone hacked the iPad. Um, oh, you know what? I'm sorry. Don't bring bring um, bring Dame Elisa and the cat back one. We always need to leave the cat back. Why? Because you're scared for Ulfo? Yeah, I'm scared for Ulfo. Dude, you keep changing it up, dude. You keep changing it up during the game. You're going to get comments. You're going to get I'm comments. I'm going to get comments, dude. You're going to get comments. I'm trying to, get, I'm trying to do these before... before Finger was I off. Think. Finger was off the piece. Finger was off the piece. <laughs> One, two, three. I'm getting outside, dude. Oh, Genevieve. 
Genevieve, first out. First to yes. escape, guys. First to escape. First she's to the like, egg. Like, she's like, the air, the air is great over <gasps> here. It's great out. There's nothing out here. Yep. All right. Zombies. So one, two, rats. Rats in the house. Rat, rat in the house. Rat in the house. Can, yep, that's right. And this guy's gonna go here. And then these are gonna split. Yep. One, two, split rats. Rat split, split rats, dude. Uh, this guy is gonna split. Split. Yeah, you're, man, those splits in this one suck so hard. Okay. Yeah. So he's gotta get through this map, dude, and we'll be done. Done yeah. forever. Zombie spawns. Oh. That oh, legit? that's legit. So she, she activates. That's it. She just activates. Okay, so that's one. She moves over. She's not gone yet. Swarm of rats. Okay. So we get moved up on. And then we have two more spawns after this. One, two. Oh, rat turner, dude. Here's where all the yep. rats come for us, guys. We've been here yep. before. We've seen this. We've seen we've seen we've seen this. We've been here. Two more spawns, dude. That rat activates, yeah. Goes okay. south, south, yeah. So he's with his rat buddies again. Another rat horde coming around the corner. Two more, dude. No more rats. Or oh, fatty. Fatty. Then nothing in sight. Grin. Rats, dude. Wow. Okay. I'm sorry, but the, the flying cat's gotta go. No, flying cat's gotta go. <laughs> flying cat's gotta no. go. And Dame flying is gonna cat. take a. Uh, the Dame is gonna take a uh, damage. For being the handler. The cat gets eaten alive, oh, dude. This cat kills me. <laughs> we had to sack our animal again. I almost want to. I almost want to just give up. No. <laughs> I almost want to give up. <laughs> no. No. Ooch. Not like this. Hooch, you've seen <laughs> this. Wow. Saw this movie. We've seen this, Lyle, except it's a cat. Who's a, who's a special cat? Did anyone ever have a cat where the cat died and cried about it? No, they never did. <laughs> Was there a cat movie? Like, you know what? The only cat thing that that I can think of is... Uh... Yeah, they, um, Sean, the, the, the rats move two per action. They don't get two actions. Lyle, do you remember this cat? This is in memory of v Vandalist, dude. Or Vin, yeah, Vin, Vindalis or Vin, Vindalis or whatever her name is. Vandalis. Yeah. What is her name? Vin, Vin, Van, 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 Vandala, Vandalis. Right here, dude. Right here. Oh. Always remember. Always remember. Always man. remember her. She she took her. She got eaten by rats. You know you know what this cat is. Who's this cat from? Anyone know what movie this cat's from? No, I don't know what whether that cat's from. Anybody? Anybody in chat? Pet Cemetery. No. <laughs> cemetery. Come on. We have to remember this cat, dude. I'm gonna move the rats as you remember Vandal Vanadis dying for the cause. And then these rats. One, two. Rat party. Rel Rel is asking if it's the homeward bound cat. It is the homeward bound cat, Bill, yes. Bill says Sassy from homeward bound. <laughs> yes. Homeward bound cat. Nicely done. Yeah. Nicely done. Damage. Okay, so the rats moved. Have to take the damage off. We have to kill Vandalus, dude. Vandalus. Van yeah. Dude, it was Van a good call Vandalus on your part. Gets hit, and then uh, Dame Lisa gets one hit. Because they're for, uh, being uh, a handler, having an emotional bond. It was emotional, dude. Rip the kitty, dude. Rip the cat. Rip the crap. <laughs> Trivia crits. <laughs> Rel yeah. digging for crits. Um, rip, dude. Rip. So okay, that's so it. That's, that's the spawn. That's it. That's the spawn. That's the way. Was that the third spawn? I think that, that was the two, fourth spawn. That was the two rats. Yes. Yeah. Didn't add the rats. Forgot to add the rats over there. All right. So now we got rats over there. Wow, dude, that was an emotional end to that, huh? That was that was an emo that was emotional, dude. What an emotional roller coaster we just went on, yeah. guys. 
Please, sir, could I have a crit? Yeah, t pass a crit to your witcher. <laughs> pass a crit to your witcher. Yes, the right. Homeward Bound cat, dude. The, that movie's the only cat movie I can think of that I was, like, sad in. You know what I mean? Oh, Homeward Bound, dude. That was a long time ago. Yeah, dude. Remember they're going out and, like, Shadow falls and breaks his leg, and then there's a... Uh, the dude, Twitter. I don't even want to talk about it, dude. <laughs> was it Shadow? No, it wasn't Shadow who breaks his leg. It's the guy played by, what's his name? Uh, the, the, the Shadow cr was the... Shadow Labrador, was the wise right? dog. The wise old dog. It wasn't Shadow. It was the crazy dog, Chase. Chase? Chance. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's it. Chance. Chance breaks his leg when Chance. he falls in the pit. Chance. And then yeah. the cat, which I forget her name, jumps down there and is like, what's wrong, Chase? Bill says the cat's name was Sassy. Oh, was it Sassy? Yeah, gets down there and he's like, ow, ow. And then Shadow's like, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, Chance. Looks like your hyperactivity got you in trouble. Shadow suddenly, it sounds like uh, he did the VO for, for Small World. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, oh, no. <laughs> it is the same voice. That's the movie. Whenever I, whenever I hear the name Shadow, that's why I'm always doing Shadow, dude. That's why I always go Shadow. <laughs> that's, that's his, yeah. Except he says Chance. He's the wise dog. Shadow. <laughs> All right. Um, my turn. It's run, yeah. run to the exit time. We got to kill these ratty butts and get out of here. So I'm going to give you an action. Thank you. Uh, with uh, Lucas. Yeah, give it to Ulfo. He, he okay, I'm going to give it to Ulfo. It. Ulfo's getting it. Ulfo gets extra action so he can get away from the kill rats, get away from rats. So we can run from the rats, dude. It's the run from the rats. This game is... Everyone thought yeah. it was easy, but no. It's the, oh, it's Lucas' turn. Um, running from the rats is what this game's about. So gave that, and I'm just going to go one, two, three. Run! One, two, three. We have to go through water one last time over here. Yeah. One, two, three. But the zombies can't get... Once out. we get... To, oh, you know what? It's nice. Oh, but we're already at the exit. Just kidding. It's gonna I was going to say, because, like, zombies can't go up banks. Right. Doesn't matter. So then I'm going to go one, two, three. Bum, bum, one, two, three. It's a tarp. Oh, I could have cast invisibility. Can I do that for free? Uh, No, it takes an action. No. I'm not going to do that, though. You could. <laughs> you can push these off. Invisibility can't on you one of push? my dudes. You have shove with her, don't you? I don't have shove with her. I have it with Cabral. Oh, you have pull with her. Yeah. Oh. Pff, pff. Can't you shove him away from here? With Cabral? Yeah, no. I'm going to give an extra action to Cabral. He's going to come down, shove him, and then run. Right, so right, right. Okay, so we're all good there. Yeah, okay, yeah. so one, two, three. Return. <clears throat> one, two, three. Up, oh, first in. Yeah, first in. First in this pool over here. Guys, found a new pool. Wee! All right, dude. This is the push. Okay, I mean, let's start with, uh, oh, yo, you should have given the extra action to Cabral instead of Ulfo. Damn it. Ooh, hand off the piece. Because if I start with... It's fine if you do Cabral. You jump down. Yeah. Yeah, you could just give it to him with Ulfo, whatever, and then just make the run. But I want to get out of, uh, Rat activation territory or kill the rats what do you have here you have five dice five plus with her and her great sword give her the action and then uh slice yeah. up some rats and then get out of there i mean it's five plus though Ooh. yeah it's a but, little it's a little dangerous but if you kill these rats you have rats pretty far away so i think you'll be able okay. to kill the rats so kill so, the rats. so you're saying stand my ground until i kill the rats just kill the rats dude okay okay start let's start with ulfo um, let's, well, uh... You shouldn't start with Ulfo. Yeah, let's, uh... No, start what? with Dame Elisa. Start with... Or, I get... Yeah, just start with her. She kills him. And then we'll move up one. I mean, I think he'll be fine. One, two, three, four. I was gonna say, because cause he has a better sword. Two guys, three plus. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? Wishing you had the dagger now, I bet. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, I know. I know. All right. So, free action, yeah, heavy, heavy sword? Heavy sword for my free action. Okay. Could kill him right here, dude. This could be it. This could be it. Schwing. Get some. Not even a problem. Not even a problem. Two. Okay. Nice, dude. All right. We'll give her the extra action and then move three. And one, two. Okay. Nice. See, it all worked out. All right. Cabral's just going to move one, two, three. And Dame Melisa is going to move one, two, three, four. Made the run, dude. Made the run. Made the run. 
We're getting there, dude. We're almost there, guys. We're almost there. Zombie turn. Is that how it ends? Yep. Let's see if we can get there. We've been here before. We have been here before. We've seen this movie. Yeah. Uh, Split. Stupid butt. Stupid butt. Yeah. Here. Rats. Rats. Uh, Gary Split, right? Yep. Move over. Split. That guy splits. Ooh, low on spectrals. Okay. She moves over. Does not go away yet, though. No. Next turn, she will. Next turn, she goes away. Okay. Spawnies. All right, four spawns. <clears throat> to the north. Just if we just can't get a streak of rats, that's what we don't want. All yeah. right, walkers, painted. painted walkers. Waka, 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 waka. Okay, three more spawns. Three more, three more. Runner. Okay. Two more spawns. Two more spawnies. Oh, one rat. Rats. Okay. Split. One. And then this guy's gonna that guy splits. Here, so then this guy splits. Gotta add one there. Okay, one more spawn. One more spawn. One more spawn. One more spawn. Bink. Double spawn. Double spawn on the first spawn. Oh my gosh. Double spawn back to the first spawn. Double spawn again. So. It would be we have three one spawns. more spawn here. And then. So three up there. Yeah, because there's two spawns up there. Yeah, so three more spawns. Yeah, three more there, spawns. Dude. Oh my gosh, dude. Three more spawns. Walker. One walker. Waka, 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 waka. Okay, two more spawns up there. <laughs> Rats. Oh, Rats. Man. They just move up. And then we have one more spawn. Oh my gosh. Rats, dude. Rats. Two rats here. Uh, okay, so these guys go. They just move up on Ulfo, yeah. Well, they don't get to Ulfo. Oh, don't. They're not oh they go up there. Yeah, sorry. I thought that door was open next to them. Yeah, one, two. Uh, one, two here. One, two. One, two. one south, south. And then, uh, yeah, west, south. And then these guys are going to go. Okay. One more spawn, dude. One, two. Okay. Hopefully it's not a double spawn. We have to hope it's not a double spawn. <laughs> nope. 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 <laughs> fatty. Fatty. Woo! Okay. It's a fatty. Oh my gosh. Okay. Ooh, dodged it, dude. That was close, man. It was close. We can't we can't win this turn though, because Ulfo doesn't have four actions. Why not? Oh. Because right. he, he won't be able to climb out of the water. Oh, we have to well, okay, we have to kill rats for insurance. Yeah, we gotta kill rats for insurance. Oh my gosh, the game's not over yet. We gotta kill rats for insurance, rats. Yeah. So how are you gonna do it? Let's start with uh, start with Ulfo, I guess. He's got this short bow. Well, we can't get. I don't want to duck. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to. Actually, let's not start with Ulfo because I don't want to level up. There's three of them over there. Oh yeah, that could be even worse. So he's got a short bow. So we have to go through. What does Dame Elisa have? Um, longbow. Longbow. Okay. So the idea is we just need to get everyone into the water at least. Yeah. And kill these rats, and that gives us one. Or those rats are going to move up, so that one, two, three rat actions. Plus, we're low on rats, dude. We're almost out. We gotta of rats. kill the rat. I think we have to kill the rats. Yeah, we have to kill the rats. The rats have okay. to die. Let's start with Dame. She's going to move over uh, to where Ulfo is and then shoot twice, I guess. But you need to be able to move. That's the thing. Like, if you do this, next turn we're going to at least get probably one rat activation. Oh, I see. I see. That's okay, so start move. with Ulfo then. Start with Ulfo. Yeah. We need Give to... the action to Dame Elisa. Uh, 
Um, so she's back over there. Oh, yeah. And then Ulfo's going sh- to uh He's going to shoot once and then move twice, I think. Shoot once. Yeah. Yeah, we got to take care of these dudes. Oh, big miss. Big miss. I think I got I think we got to move though, right? I don't know. Or I think I... I think if you take one shot and move and move one or okay. if we can all get to the water, I think we can be cool. I think you're right. We should just move out. Yeah, I'll just But we got to just... try to clear them in some way. Whoever doesn't clear them yeah, I mean, I mean, we can all be meat shields for each other. So. That's true. That's true. Yeah, I mean, so as, as long just as we, move. we thin them out, we can do this. So yeah. just move. Yeah, get into uh, the water, dude. West, west. Yeah, <laughs> get into the water. Jump in the water. Yeah. Jump in the water. Yeah, jump in the water. You tried. Um, you tried. What up, Sultanas? Good to see you. So the dame is going to move over with the free. Take a shot. Uh, move over this way. Yeah. Move over to the east for free. Take one shot up. Shoot him with the bow. Shoot him with the bow. Gets one. Gets one. Okay. Then jump in the water. Yeah, jump in the water, I guess. Jump in the rat water. We just have to hope for no extra activations or no double spawns and crazy splitting and all that. Yeah. Okay, Cabral. Just jumping in the water. So just jump in the water? I guess. You're kind of right. We just might just have to take a, a rat fight, dude. Yeah, so jump in the water, then jump to the exit, I guess. Well, don't we want to be meat shields, potentially? You have. Full oh, yeah, health. yeah, jump in the water. Just jump in the water. <laughs> jump in the water, dude. We're going to have to meat shield. You tried to jump out, we're like, no, you're not. Yeah. <laughs> like, you're going to sit here and take just as many bites as we are. Yeah. Have I missed you playing Talisman yet, says Sultanus? Not yet, Ta- Sultanus. I installed Talisman Digital actually yesterday to take a look at it. Um, in a couple weeks, we're going to bust out some Talisman, I think. We're going to maybe dive into some Talisman digital, so stick around for sure. It's going to be fun. Will the rats split when they move towards you next turn from that spot? Oh, shite. They will. Oh, yeah, they will. And they're going to split, yeah. We still have rats. They're even, though, so... Yeah, they're even, there's so There's two okay. there, so maybe we shouldn't kill them anymore. Yeah, maybe we should kill them. Just run. Yeah, I'm just going to... It's my turn here. Um, yeah. There's no point... Well, I can give an extra activation. Who's first next turn? You will be first next turn. So I can give the extra activation to say, who who's going to be our big spinning up guy? Who's our best spinning up option? Burnbound. If we need to kill, no, with a short sword. No, I'm saying with. Oh, I see. Is it Lucas has five? Dame Elisa has five. What's the heavy sword? Doesn't the heavy sword have a billion for less? Heavy sword is two dice, three plus. Two dice, yeah. So if we can do some spinning, well maybe maybe I give it to. Oh, I can't give it to myself. No. Um, so who do I want to give it to for next round? Well, awesome. You can give it to. We'll need some help for sure. So join us. For well, sure. you can give it to Cabral. He can just shove them right if 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 they get in our zone. Oh yeah 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 yeah. That's true. And then we can yeah. make a run. So I'll give it to you. <laughs> just I'll just give it to you. Okay. Here, you can have my action. Yeah. And you can have my action. All right. So I'm just gonna just jump jumping in. The water. in. Everybody in the pool. Yeah, just jumping in. Jumping in the yeah. water. Jumping in the water, man. And the fish uh, man's jumping in the water, dude. Jump fish man. In, jumping in the water. Yeah. Okay. Feels so good. <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, Genevieve is already in the water. So, splishy splash. Okay. Okay, here we go, guys. Here's the moment. Here's the moment of truth. We got to figure yeah. this out. Let's do this. Yeah. So, the yeah, Necromancer, uh, Queen Savara leaves. Yeah, she goes, wow! So that spawn up there is now permanent. She and, uh... Ascends. Ascends. To necromancer heaven. Yeah. And now we move everything. So here we go. Now we're gonna move all this stuff. So, one, two. Uh, one, two. One, two. Two. 
Okay. And now the rats that are near us have to do a split and end up. Yeah. Boom, boom. And then, yep. Oh, now they're just rats. looking at us. We're all, we're all in the pool. We're just looking yeah, at Yeah, they're like on the rats. edge, like. <laughs> okay, Four dude, spawns, dude. Here we go. Four spawns. Dramatic loop time, guys. Dramatic loop. Here we go. Four spawns to survive rats. Is this good? That is a skip. Is it a skip? Yeah. Oh, nice. That's convenient. All right, gonna keep going. Uh, oh, fatty burster missed. Fatty burster, oh, nothing. Three left. Three right, left. Three more. Three more. Three more. Three more. Three more. They're, they're looking at me, Ray. <laughs> <laughs> they have tainted Walker. No. Too tainted. Go walk, go walk, go walk, go. <laughs> they're looking at me. <laughs> so good. They're looking at me, Ray. It's too too tainted. Yeah. So there should be it's another two? one. It's two. Oh my god. Yeah. Two more spawns. Okay. And now uh, two more spawns. Two more spawns. Walker. One Standard walker. walker. Walk, go, walk, okay. Go, walk, go, walk, go. And then final and spawn. Down. Three walkers, walkers, dude. Yeah. We did it. We did it. Yes, we did it. We got we away it. from it. Yes. <laughs> Those rats are. They were like, yeah, they're like, ready to go, dude. <laughs> they're like, we can't, we can't jump in the water. We're like. <laughs> <laughs> So now we, we just make the move, guys. We now make the move. Oh, here we go. We're making the push. Here we go. Push. Making the push. Making the push. So I'm going to go one, one, two, because it's a bank. One, two, I'm a fish. One, two, oh. I'm a fish. It's a tarp. One, two, it's I'm Liam Neeson. I'm Liam Neeson. It's already out. I don't know. Liam Neeson was already out. <laughs> one, two. He's Liam Neeson. He's already done. Liam right. Neeson. And then you're one, two. One, two. One two. <laughs> one two one two. Oh my gosh. And we did it. Boom, we accomplished it, dude. Mission accomplished, guys. Woo! Uh, we got to the exit and we all we survived. Redemption! Woohoo! I'm so confused I need to watch this in the beginning. Yes, you do. <laughs> yes, you do. We did it though, guys. Oh my god. Guys, this mission would be impossible if you don't pick up the X right away. Oh, it would be super savage. I mean, here's here's the thing I was going to say that whole time is, like, we, we decided to make a run and a push, right? Yeah. Um, If we didn't get the green one immediately, we'd just be doing a whole lot more killing. Um, yeah. Because we didn't do the killing, we almost die because we... Dude, we're... We have three rats, ref, three rats left in the supply. Um, We're almost out of spectral walkers. Yeah. We have one more in the supply for spectral, so they would have started activating. And then yeah. tainted... We have four more. So Ugh. it was just a matter of time before uh, the tainteds and all these things started activating. Then we die because the idea with Zombicide yeah. is you're supposed to kill. You're supposed to kill in this game. Yeah. That's why the, the XP tracker up there, you know, we just got lucky and made it to make a push. But it might have not been the best um, choice. You know what I mean? Yeah. We could have died at the very end there in this game. Well, well, the thing is, this this can easily, because of like, the splits in the middle and the in the pinch points in this map, it so easily could can overwhelm you. Like I mean, we were on the verge of being completely overwhelmed there. Yes. And um, it's just Very. one of those things where, like, this might be one of those missions where if we kept losing, we would have to start pairing things back. You know, we've we've done that before where we're like we're adding too many things to this mission. Hmm. You know, we'd be like, okay, well, like, no more rats, no more spectrals, no more, you know, whatever. Like it, it might have been one of those, you know. If I don't know. you know, if we weren't, if we weren't lucky. That no, no. Been... I mean, the rats are super savage. Now that we also have spectrals in there, I see what you're saying. That we've added all these new layers. Um, yeah. And uh, stuff like that, especially if we were to use the rat, the rat king, where the rat king, the yeah. rat king with the rats. I mean, it would have made this super savage. And that would have been maybe something we pair back if it's just too difficult. I mean, the challenge is fun. Um, yeah. Zession has been saying the whole time that these rats are super hard. Uh, yeah. and I, I see why people might remove rats, um, especially in water levels, right? Water having to take two moves. The water with the so. rats is just unfair. It's yeah, like it you're almost moving half unfair. speed and they're moving double speed, right? So it's like, it's, yeah, it's and then, really, really rough. And Bill brings up a point too. He says, how would you beat this one if the blue and green X's are these two, or I think he means these two rooms, Bill? Or is yeah, it those two Yeah, because you have rooms? to like go through water to get this would be to these. Super, near a spawn point. Near spawn point, yeah, it's just, it would be so rough. It would either be a really long game, 
or um yeah e even the other one is tough because that's water up by up there as well um and if you're getting well, the thing necros, is you would never have to go for that one um if you went for the ones oh on you shouldn't top. have to yeah yeah, yeah you, shouldn't you shouldn't have, have to, to. Based um, on odds, yeah, yeah, because yeah. you're either going to get the green or blue. Because you only need one of the X's. The thing yeah. is, if you get the blue X, if you get the blue X up, if you here, get the blue X, you you activate the blue spawn. Yeah, now this yeah. is an active spawn, and now this is even more savage to get out. Yeah. And you can't get yeah. out up there. You have to come this way. You have to. You come have this to way. go that way. So I think yeah. us getting lucky twice in a row is super crazy good. Because you're right, yeah. this mission, it's a hard mission. Impossible. It's, it's said it said it hard, right? It said it was hard. I yeah, it said it was hard. Yeah. yeah, this is a hard mission, and I can see why because yeah, you would hard, really six plus survivors, one hundred twenty minutes. Yeah. You really gotta if you're gonna, and, and I mean, people that say they play with everything. I mean, the book recommends you play Black Plague um, and Friends and Foes for this one. We're not even, in, yeah. we don't even have Green Horde stuff involved in this one. So if you put, you can put Green Horde into this one, um, and make it even crazier with the different kinds of walkers. You know what yeah. I mean? The orc oh, walkers. But the rats with the double spawns in this one are really crazy well, imagine already. If, if Green Horde was in here and that horde spawn was triggering more with like uh yeah. orc walkers, orc fatties, and everything yeah. coming in from up there. Dude. Yeah, I don't know, dude. It would have been insane. This it mission been is a hard one. Yeah. This mission so if anyone's looking for a challenging mission that is uh, fighting through all your zombicide stuff, I'd say yeah, definitely give this one a a, a shot with putting everything in because whew. Yeah, I it mean, is we savage. got lucky. This it, one's a, really hard, yeah. Yeah, yeah, this one's had, This one's super savage, dude, super savage. Yeah. Where was the blue Where X? Where was the blue X? Yeah, okay. Let's see, let's see. Let's is see. this one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's right there. <laughs> I mean, that's just, uh, it's this one. <laughs> right one I go to, savage, dude. Yeah. <laughs> wasn't rigged, I swear it's not rigged. Yeah. I swear it isn't rigged. That's just crazy. I don't know, man. That I started with that one because it was right there. Good, but you could, could you call it and you just flip it over and it is right i know and now everyone's like crit can't beat it but it was rigged right okay okay guys <laughs> oh my all God. right all right yes so um in a few weeks <laughs> it's just i can't believe that happened that's crazy <laughs> i should go to vegas right now dude i should i should go to vegas <laughs> and be rich i gotta go yeah. gamble on something or something um <laughs> Sure, X's are the first room. Yeah, sure, two X's, first room, exactly. First call, first call. Rawr, I don't know what you're talking about. Rawr, rawr, rawr. Um, so when we get back after a few weeks here, let's see, let's see what the next quest is going to be. The next quest will be quest five. Where is it? Uh, quest five. Boom. Quest five. Oh, scroll down. Scroll down uh, is the pale shelter. Um, so this is going to be one. It's a sixty minute or it's a medium one. Um, and this one will start introducing green horde stuff back in. So we will no longer be playing with like black plague stuff, which is basically just the standard walker, standard runner, standard fatty. Yeah. They will be swapped out for orc walkers, orc runners, orc fatties. Um, as you guys saw in our last stuff, this was kind of return to black plague with this mission. Um, but uh, medium mission coming in here, dude. Um, any survivor may escape through these. So we have to go through the exit zone. We all have to survive. So we you either you either make it to the green spawn zone, which is your exit zone, or you go to the blue spawn zone, um, which is your exit zone. But you have to get the green key and the, or the blue key to open up those doors. And this is more water. The and there's more water on this one. Look at that. Yeah. Lots so, of hedges, lots of water. Yeah. So it looks like we have we got to go around. We got to we got to find either the blue or the green and then beeline it over there. And then but like the thing is. Those the blue spawn activates when you get the blue X, and the green spawn activates when they get the green X. So we'll be spawning behind the closed door. So by the time you open the oh. door, there's gonna be a horde there. Oh no! Then you have to defeat the horde and then stand on the zone with the spawn with no zombies on it. Yeah. Sessions recommending jump. Oh my gosh, that does do. But I mean, the good thing is, um, yeah, hey. jump would be good here, and also having a uh, having a what was it? The holy the holy orb. Yeah, grenade or whatever make a big clear or something yeah big clear getting that set up so when you open the door you just throw it and you hey just but that x that people. x right next to the spawn point if that happens to be that blue x again says the rough rough dog rough, 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 rough. yeah um if that happens to be the blue x <laughs> yeah <laughs> then we'll just run down to the blue spot yeah win. just uh, yeah just just win dude just win you know, we'll just win you know that's how that's how we're doing this because we want to get to zombicide invaders so i'm just <laughs> I'm just stacking Don't the deck. Say it out loud. I'm just stacking the deck. Like no, no shame, no shame. Dude, we're gonna get so many comments on this one. No that integrity. Was. They're gonna be like, thinking like, you didn't really like you. You set that up rigged. Hacks, hacks. No integrity. 
Uh, Sultana says, do you have, do you have a moment to quickly describe the rules? Well, basically Sultanus, if you're not familiar with Zombicide, Zombicide is a miniatures co-op survival type game where you're fighting off zombies. Um, the difficulty level, as you'll see, if I jump over here, um, you have different, you have usually with two players, you'll play three survivors each at the top of the app up there. You gain XP by killing zombies. Every time you kill a zombie, you gain an experience or more. And yeah. you're, and you get experience from doing other things yeah. depending on the quest. Yeah. And as you as you gain experience, the difficulty level goes up, which means harder things spawn as you increase in your XP level, and more and more of zombies that are increased difficulty, either in numbers or difficulty, spawn. And uh, you have to accomplish your mission, which we were just kind of showing you there. You have different yeah. quests that have different in-game. So on yeah, a map. each each quest will be different. Sometimes it's you know kill everything. Sometimes it's find an item. Uh, pick up those X's of like finding items, uh, make it to one point of the map. There's all sorts of different things. Um, as you gain experience, you're going to gain new, um, each character is different. So they're going to gain new skills that'll help yeah. you out. Like you can search and get new uh, actions, inventory and equipment stuff and stuff like, like that. Yeah. Um, and basically there's an AI. Uh, so all the players, you take turn going through all the players turns and then the game goes and then there's set rules for how the zombies will move and spawn and attack you. And so you basically go through, you know, rounds, yep. um, you know, until you get your objective. Yeah. There's different phases. And so each, yeah. each base box of zombicide comes with about 10 standard quests. There's a lot more quests that you can download that people have made, um, may or may not be play tested. Um, but we have been going through the last five, five plus years, going through all the zombicide boxes, doing all the quests, so there's like there's like four modern boxes. There was like you know we're on our third sort of black plague green horde box, and then invaders is coming up soon. And then they just did a reboot on Kickstart for modern. Um, it's so much more, stuff. Yeah. So if you stuff. if you enjoy a lot that of kind content, of game, it's a great game. You can play it solo too. So if you're if no one's familiar, you're just now jumping in. Yeah. This is the this is the second expansion to Green Horde, which is like way deep in into the things. But you can buy a box and play a bunch of stuff, and it's all in the rulebook for you. So. Definitely check it out if it's something you're interested in. Like, yeah, like you said, Lyle, I think the beauty of this is replayability. You can play a lot of stuff with this awesome companion app, and um, every game will turn out different, basically. Every game unique. Uh, every game unique. Every game unique. <laughs> um, yeah, it's cool. It's something cool if you're looking to have, like, a different survival co-op experience. The beauty of this thing is the fact that it is co-op and that yeah, cool. your dungeon master is taking care of you for the game, so you don't have to worry about it, which is pretty fun. And if you like zombies or you like... And this is, like... I don't know if you mentioned it. This is we're playing more in the medieval theme version of the game versus when we say modern, it's more set in a city like setting with like yeah, buildings like and cars. It's like present day present stuff, day zombie. Like, yeah. Yeah. Instead of picking up like axes and short swords and stuff like that, you'll be finding submachine guns and shotguns and, and all that kind of stuff. So um if Look that's what you're interested in, yeah, there's there's the a modern variant. Um so what I was mentioning in Kickstarter was um their Kickstarter for Modern just ended. What happened was they did the Modern series first, then they did this fantasy series. But what also they did with this fantasy series is streamline a lot of the rules uh, that were a little clunky in the first in the first iteration. Um, so they just rebooted that whole Modern thing with updated rule set to make it a little bit better. Um, the the Zombicide Invader, which is the box that we're going to head to next, got delivered um, probably in the last six months or something like that. I forget. Um, but that that theme is going to be in space. So they are they are continually adding content for this game, um, and we've been yeah exactly we've been we've we've been playing this game for over five years. We started this channel playing that game, yeah. <laughs> playing this game. Yeah. yeah. So cool. Check it out. There's the link right there. Simon uh, com slash product slash obviously. You can see all the expansions and stuff there. So yeah, if no one's checked it out by now, check it out. <laughs> awesome. We've been doing it a long time, but it's a lot of fun. So. Lyle, you'll be solo streaming tomorrow and be playing some Key Snorge. Key Actually, Snorge, I, I don't think I can. Um, there's a lot of freelance that sort of popped Work. up for me this week, um, Work. starting yesterday. And so, surprise, surprise meeting and presentation in uh, in Japan for, for the for the the company I'm freelancing for. I'm not going there, uh, but I'm I'm making the presentation materials. <laughs> Surpri for it. Surprise trip to Japan. <laughs> no, I'm not doing this. The, the company's as a surprise trip to Japan. Surprise. Which I have to prepare a lot of uh, presentation materials for. So yeah. I don't think I'll be able to stream. Uh, if I can, then yeah. you'll you'll see me at the at the usual time. I'm hoping that I can, but um, cool. it all depends on what happens tonight. <laughs> oh, I see you, Lyle. Oh. Yeah. 
Well, but I will be solo streaming all of next week uh, while Chris is on the road. So you can you can count on me streaming all of next uh, week. Rough, 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 rough. And if I find time, maybe I'll join you, dude. Maybe I'll join oh, you. Oh, really? I, find time, okay. I have my laptop. It's really crappy. But nice. we could do something like real basic. <laughs> maybe We'll see. Like from your nice. end, we'd have to figure it out. But yeah, so awesome. Go play some games, guys. Rock and roll. Um, enjoy this key storage up through your Pokemon Go. If you haven't joined in our Discord, come Pokemon Go friend us. Bill, 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 Bill. Bill, 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 Bill. Mortivis. Mortivis. Bill. <laughs> uh, you guys go hop in the Discord. You can find games guys to uh, games to play with um, and that kind of thing. I uh, hope you guys enjoy playing games. Go play some games. Hop in the Discord. Show us what you're playing. Share the camp. Slap that subscribe button and the yeah. like button. Um, <laughs> we really appreciate all your guys' support. So really, thank you, thank you, thank you. Bill posted his friend code. Yay! Oh, yes! <laughs> More Pokemon goers. More Pokemon goers. Yes. Um... So yeah, we'll see you. We'll see you there. We'll see you in the Discord and having fun and stuff like that. And um, rock and roll, play some games, Lyle. Have fun. Yeah. Have fun this week. Have fun. Thank you. I'll, I'll see you guys when I get back. It'll be a new iteration, and we're playing a whole bunch more games. Rock and roll. Peace, good gaming. Thanks for joining Peace us today, Peace, good gaming, guys. everybody. Like I said, thank you for all the support. People on YouTube asked, why aren't these guys, you know, finding more of it? But we rely on you guys. Crit Camp is grassroots. So tell your friends if you enjoy the camp, and we're always trying to grow the community. Yeah. Thank you. Cheers. Yeah. Peace. And if you gaming. want to find us on YouTube, throw throw some likes up on our YouTube videos so we can get an algorithm. <laughs> so we can get Peace an algorithm. Dude, an algorithm. <laughs> All right, man. We'll see you guys later. Peace. Good uh, game. Bye. bye.